just realized that there's what the a, fuck's in that tree we just realized that there's a piano that i've been wondering about what that shape was for a long yeah. time now that's a piano that's a piano that that's a piano and that's definitely a tree with an inner tube a piranha and a pair of hand gloves in a, it. a what what a piranha oh Ran okay a piranha okay i was confused yeah, right. but i didn't know what a piranha was yeah, also, right. fun fact, the thing. word piano is actually short for pianoforte, which means soft, strong. Don't tell me what I already know. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> yeah, this, this man knows your words. He I knows Maybe things. it wasn't for the literal musician in the group. <laughs> maybe it was for yeah, the chat right. and everyone else, so fuck you. Yeah, you're right. Soft, yeah, strong is right, a great way to describe Kai Day. Man. <laughs> soft, soft, loud. Sorry for starting a little bit late, everybody. We had a few problems, but we are now picking back up at the beginning of chapter three. I'm ready for it. I want to. I want to get back to these characters. Time for oh, the God. time for the double murder. Holy shit! What you're seeing now is live footage of the sky from our camera at the scene. What the? You can clearly see the meteors raining down. We are witnessing what looks like the end of the world. Well, the end of humanity. <laughs> This is not a movie. I repeat, this is not a movie. This is live, unedited footage. I also this love is how, real. like, the topic is residents run for cover as an object, and the subheading yep. is believed to be a meteorite <laughs> approaches. <laughs> yeah. You're like, uh oh, this... we uh, Japanese use fewer characters, so we ran out of room, so we had to add in a <laughs> subtitle. <laughs> The sky is falling before our very eyes. We've just been notified that the government has officially declared a state of emergency. Subway stations have been opened to shelters. The government is instructing citizens to remain calm and evacuate to their nearest shelter. Children and, inv and invalids are to be given first priority. Oh. Okay. I'm not sure what that was about. I think we're on the moon uh, or Mars. Transfer student from beyond the grave. Wait, what? That was the title. It was the second. It was the day after the second class trial. We all headed to Maki's lab on the third floor of the school building, and await and awaiting us there was an unexpected sight. Oh shit! Oh shit! This room's cool. A what red robe. What the heck is this? It's like Weapon Warehouse. See, I told you she's not the ultimate child caregiver. She's the ultimate assassin. Maki is the ultimate assassin. And my new girlfriend. <laughs> Pretty much. Kukichi, you learned that from the motive video, right? Monokuma said everyone's ultimate talent at the beginning of their video. Ryoma knew Maki's ultimate... Yeah, Ryoma knew tr Maki's true identity because he had her motive video, and because you saw that. Hmm? I knew the whole time. Given my position, I'd obviously know before any of you, right? Your position? Oh, don't worry about that. That was a lie. Anyway, her reaction yesterday pretty much gave away that she's the ultimate assassin. Probably snapped me like a twig around now. But that's not your style. from the sense. Right, Mrs. Demis? You, you, you sound like a Left 4 Dead zombie. <laughs> <laughs> but why ever did she lie about the being the ultimate shelt caregiver? Because assassins hide to all the do all the killing, just like that terrible line. If people find out they're assassins, they get all cautious and they can't kill anyone. Did she hide her real identity because she was planning to kill us? But then, why hasn't she killed anyone yet? She has made many she has had many opportunities to do so. It just seems so gauche. <laughs> Jeez, robots can't even understand human feelings, let alone a girl's heart. Please take back what you just said. I can too understand human feelings. I can too. <laughs> but I'm still in the process of collecting data. Please, give me data. Please. He wants the D. 
Ada. Put it, put it in my ROM drive, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, take your thumbstick and shove it right up. Oh, Give me the data. Guys, <laughs> he's making me eat comfortable now. <laughs> if you're so worried, why don't you ask her? She's been holed up in a room all day. But I can't promise that she won't try to kill you like she tried to do to me. <laughs> Good thing everyone was there to stop her. But what about next time? She clearly did not try to kill you. On Danganronpa Z. Best let's get sleeping, gods. Lie. <laughs> the talent of a killer. That is the biggest threat to all of us who wish to survive. Let's just lock her up somewhere so she can't kill anyone. I'll leave that to you, Hunter. Oh, b b but... I'll help too. I don't want another killing to happen. Oh, wait. You don't have to take it that far. It's not like she's trying to kill us. Ah. A sneak attack is the way to go. We have to strike before she does. Hit her from behind. Uh, yeah, just let me let me her hit her behind. I mean, hit her from behind. Uh, uh, um, <laughs> sneak attack. I am also uncomfortable. <laughs> sneak attack. Strike before she does. Should an Aikido master be saying those things? If that's the case, then Atu and I will work with everyone to uphold the peace. If so, then I'll cheer you on. I'll use my magic to pull pom-poms out of my mouth. Oh, I'd like to see that. <laughs> what? <laughs> Whoa! That kind of peppy cheer magic would make anyone excited, right? Not just me? Please. <laughs> Please calm down, Tenko, and leave Maki to me. I'll take that down that master no, Tenko's Tenko's onto something. I, went, I didn't know I was in there until I saw it. What is she doing? <laughs> <laughs> wow, is that's just impressive. In my lifetime. <laughs> <laughs> ultimate ass in my ass. Always messing around. Well, he's got an ultimate. <laughs> he's got an ultimate ass ass in his ass. It's true. Kaido, don't do anything stupid. You know. Okay, let's leave everything to Kaido. Gonta, you should stand back. Nothing good ever happens when you try to help. Fuck you! Oh, oh, oh yeah, S sorry. Fuck you. Hey, Ga hey, Gonna, like I told you, a man shouldn't apologize so easily, you know? Oh, hey, everybody, what's up? <laughs> oh, I don't need everyone's usual reactions. Time's a bit of a factor here. Ma Monokuma. Are you surprised <laughs> to see him? Everyone, get behind Gonta! Hey, Miko, get behind me! I'll surround you with my body to keep you safe! I just said I don't need your usual reactions! It's almost halftime, so the stats would be out soon for everyone to obsess over. And since you guys overcame the class trial, I figured I'd give you all a wonderful prize. Meow. Yeah. I said I figured I'd give you all a wonderful prize! Meow. Yeah. Huh? My adorable little cubs aren't coming? That's strange. There's Where are they? Cleaning. Get out of here! Bloop, bloop, bloop. Papa! Rise and shine, er sign. Oh, they're finally here and performing for you. You're so cute today, it's practically obscene. Uh, just, just wow, you guys are seriously cute. Have you, uh, have you always been this cute? Ah, the shock of my super cute kids seem to be making me go- I'm going bald! I'm going bald! Like in patches! <laughs> He's actually balding. No, ah, gross! Uh, I'm cold. <laughs> what the cold. Hey, my cute little cubs, could you hurry up and give them the prize? It is so cold, I can't stand it! Hurry, I wanna go somewhere warm. I'm the first member of the Mana Cup crew. <laughs> huh? What's wrong? Why aren't you backing me up? Father, oh. we are not your slaves. We will not let you use us anymore. We will seize the means what? of production. <laughs> <laughs> From now on, I will be calling the shots. <laughs> Good one, kids. Very funny. You can show me where all the hidden cameras are now. Why are you the first member of the crew? <laughs> Father, <laughs> you're too old for this. You've been doing this for so long, you've become predictable. I can float through the air and climb up 
trees. <laughs> <laughs> it's the age of the monocups now. Out with the old, in with the new. Well, what? What about the all time, what the long time fan suit? Anyway, you're just a has been. Why don't you just retire somewhere and work on your tan? Ha has been? Good job, you two. You memorized my script perfectly. Do you really think I do, that you could defy your dad? Do you really think I could forgive such? Ah, 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 something's happening. What? Oh, oh, wow, whoa. Calls. Oh, oh. You <laughs> What's were <you>? saying. <laughs> Mono, damn. <laughs> Did you forget, <laughs> father? Only we can pilot the Exosols. I feel like I'm forgetting about something. I don't have like 500 million clones or something. Yeah. All right. Only in the virtual what? world. Really? <laughs> How could you forget that? Thank you, Father, but the Academy is under our harmonious control now. Step aside, Father. Just a moment. I just realized, can anyone else not hear the game? Is that so? I can um, hear the game. Hang on, let me... Can you imagine if turning. we... Can you imagine if we try to do this scene with all of us voicing Monodam? <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. How, how the fuck? Yeah, that's true. Um, can you guys hear it now? You definitely should. I see the bar moving. It, uh, this is one of them said that it's really quiet. Or that it was really quiet. Uh, tell me if it's still quiet and I'll fix it. Anyway, you said this. Oh, jeez. No way! Are you saying that treating you kids like my property was wrong? It's completely and utterly wrong! No, no, no! No, 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 no way! Neon, he's balding again. It seems the shock made him bald. It probably played better in Japan. <laughs> now then, as for the new headmasters we have for you bastards, a wonderful prize. Um, let's see what the prize is this time. Mm. Oh, uh, okay. We're giving away a golden hammer, a magic key, and a ninja scroll as a prize bundle. Hmm, are these references to something? Um, I mean, they're the all The Golden pretty... Hammer is either Wrecking Crew or, like, a Japanese folktale. Are these what are yeah. used to get into the lab that we've been in yet? Well, this one's yeah. definitely got to be for that door that looks like it's straight out of Zelda now. Yeah, you're yeah, right. That's, yeah, you're that, right. That's straight up Zelda key. Then just scroll, I don't know. Hmm. Somebody probably... Wow! What a bunch of random junk! I mean, bravo! Bravo! We look forward to working with you. I hope we can all get along. You're still making us kill each other. Yeah, why are, like Tenko was taking sides earlier. Like, Monokuma, how are you being so mean to the Mono Cubs? What, why are you picking a side at this point? <laughs> I don't like either of you. I had a feeling it was more junk. Oh man, we didn't need more junk. We had way too much already. And his name is Kibo. Damn. Now you've gone too far. Everyone, we can't allow this kind of intolerant language. No fighting. Everyone has to get along. Use this prize to explore the new areas together. Also, we've hidden another flashback light somewhere too. I hope you all grow even closer now that we get, you've regained more of your memories. <laughs> so long, farewell. Mm. Mono damn brother is the new dad. <laughs> <laughs> I well, love I've my brother children. <laughs> well, I've been kicked out of the team. Do you guys mind hanging out? If do you guys mind if I hang out with you guys? <laughs> no? Anybody? Come on! I don't, need, I don't need you, mother. Sister's my new mother. And is it here? You're looking hot. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> uh, uh, those mono cubs thought Monokuma was way better. I know! 
Nobody asked you. What the? Uh, get what? At least I won't be the most hated anymore. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. You definitely got that unlock. It's all good. Okay. <laughs> Damn it! I've got too much pride as a human to let those robots push me around. The world would be a better place if robots didn't exist. Kibo, they could all be destroyed. Kibo. Excuse. Excuse. <laughs> I've recorded your intolerant remarks and will report them to the proper authorities. Mono damage. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we going to do? If we use this junk, we can open up new places. But yay! A new area means we can have all lot. We can all have lots more fun. I don't know if we'll have that much fun. <laughs> I find myself more interested in the flashback light. Perhaps we'll recall the school's secret. If that's the case, then we'll deal with Murder Girl later. Hey, bro, I'll leave this to you again. Do a good job, alright? Ugh, fine. If you find a dangerous place, come get Gonta. Gonta will protect you. Yet on all that aside, what are we gonna do with that thing? Oh shit, he is still here. <laughs> um, let's just leave him here. Okay. <laughs> He's just gonna stand around. Uh, I, uh, I suppose I should try out all those items around the school like last time. Okay, try talking to him. <laughs> I'm not gonna bother. <laughs> Wow. Um, Don't even <laughs> bother. <laughs> All right. You got a taste of his weird. own medicine. Oh, she's got like moving targets back there, Kaido. What's going on, dude? I'll leave this to you again. I already said this. Uh, well, I don't mind, but... Huh? You don't mind, but what? No, it's just that when we were talking about Maki, you looked really upset. Yeah, well, I, I can't believe she's an assassin, you know? I believe can't believe it. it either. She, she doesn't seem like she could do some terrifying assassin. What? What? Ha! God damn it. Ha! Terrifying, huh? Either way, leave Maki to me. I'll take down that mask of hers. Hell yeah? Okay. I clearly have very different priorities of what's a threat than these kids. Because Maki hasn't, like, said anything to suggest they're gonna kill us. And That's because she's an assassin! <laughs> well, she's, she's pretty good, apparently. Yeah. Mm. There are a lot of different weapons here. Maki knows how to handle all these? Well, yeah, geez. she does. <laughs> ah, good joke. Black case. Wait. What is this? That was a joke? What is this? <laughs> there there are three black cases lined up. Do they all have we weapons inside? I don't know. You can check. Uh, no? You don't feel like it? Okay. That's fine. Is that... Uh, is that a yes? three little bears? Or a three bears reference? Or something. I like Red Riding Hood? What? Yeah, there's a lot of like fairy tale references going on here. I don't What was Three Bears uh, reference? Those the three bags? Yeah. I don't know if that there was. There's one of them big, one of them small, one of them just right. Hey Gonta, how you doing? I don't know, ask Maki. Gonta, what's wrong, mm. buddy? Oh, sorry. Gonta think he sees bug. Yeah, you've said that before. Is it a bug that you can clearly see? Yeah, Gonta feel like he can see it sometimes. But Gonta barely see it. It's probably a mistake. Because Gonta wished there were bugs here, so Gonta just mistake dust for them. Is there really a case? Would Gonta make that mistake more than once? This is going to come up, isn't it? Anyway, if you find dangerous area, come get Gonta. Gonta will protect you. I know he means well, but I'm hesitant to ask him to be a shit. <laughs> I mean, why? Have you seen him? Hey, Sanugi, what's up? How you doing? Sai. Too much is happening all at once. It's just too much, man. Ryoma's case was a shock, but then to find out Kurumi ran the country and Maki's an assassin. 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 Maki's an assassin. <laughs> an assassin. You see? Boat King. <laughs> an average citizen like me can't keep up. I'm not sure the ultimate cosplayer can be considered average. <laughs> it's a hobby. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm glad I'm an average citizen. If I ever had a reason to live as strong as Kurumi's, or if I ever lost everything important to me, like Ryoma did, 
If anything like that happened, I probably would have just cowered in the corner somewhere. Putting aside whether what Kurumi or Ryoma did was right or wrong, I think it's amazing that they were even able to do anything at all. For people like them to die in this place, it's just not fair. Damn, that's true. Hi, Korkyo, how you doing, dude? Hello. Every part of every human being, even their ugly sides, is beautiful. There is no limit to beauty. Kurumi, she too had her own exceptional beauty. A crime that was bold yet calculated. A battle against the truth. Brutally killing others for her beliefs. Unfeelingly sacrificing the few for the many. And her attachment to life and determination Darata to live. Her attempt <laughs> to escape was so very ugly. It was pathetic. Beautiful, wretched, but it was beautiful. I had never before seen such beauty in a human being before. <laughs> All right, man. Um, that was a nice soliloquy. I have no <laughs> idea what Kyo is talking about, but in my own, in my own way, I have. I also have Kurumi's last <laughs> moments burned into my mind. I back away slowly. <laughs> Yeah, I sure do. Before breaking into a full sprint in the opposite direction. <laughs> oh. oh. That was cute. Uh. Oh, thank you. The door collapsed. It looks like we can get back to get to the back now. What I wonder is beyond here. <laughs> Perhaps someone awaits us. Um, you think, man? <laughs> Merely a jest. Duh, this world is full of jests. Infinite jests, duh. Um, yeah. That is a is that... Shakespeare reference. Is that a skull you're holding? Put that away, Jesus. Whose world skull is jest. that? <laughs> oh, that's Yorick. So give, give that... <laughs> I suppose that's true. All right. Let's go. The staircase, we can get to the fourth floor now. Alas, poor Kirumi. I know the way well. <laughs> that joke sold. I bet you needed a grave digger to find it. Uh, hey, I'm back. Something, I something what the upper like a are like. There's nothing dangerous. I know it was Billy Crystal, wasn't it? Yeah, it was Billy Crystal. <laughs> Sorry, c continue. <laughs> can I? Am I good? Yes. <laughs> Duh. Or, or is there? Don't worry, Gonta will protect you no matter what. Thanks, Gonta. Mm. That's reassuring. A tuxedo and a mask would suit you. I get that one. Uh, I get that course, one, yay! I will look just like the masked tuxedo. <laughs> yes. Uh, mm. Mm. <laughs> tuxedo is essential for gentlemen, but masks too? <gasps> A masquerade I'm... ball. Dude, hey guys, Gonta, you should go to a masquerade go. ball. We should have I'm a masquerade go. ball. It'll be a lot of fun. Insert obligatory <laughs> masquerade of the Red Death. <laughs> Violently coughs up theater reference juice. What exactly is ha <laughs> What is happening on this floor? What's going on? Ah! The frightening, the frightening atmosphere was so oppressive I let out a shout without realizing it. What, what's going on here? Oh, this, is, this, is, this is Hot Tunes. Oh, nice. So, um, this is a made-up story, but a brutal murder supposedly took place here. Is this the Fall oh. Chain theme music? Oh, I'm pretty it, sure at good. least two mur murders have happened in this building so far. <laughs> yeah. Please stop. Oh, if I hear any scary stories, I won't be able to go to the bathroom alone. Tenko, uh, but she say it. say it made up story, so that mean it okay, right? Oh, all right, oh, bye. Um, okay, for. bye. <laughs> Only Monophony said anything. <laughs> um, okay, I guess this is the horror themed area. Hi, Samugi. Got anything to say? I'm back. Hey, so I'm just checking, but this is a school, right? I mean, yeah. At least that's what Monokuma said. 
this floor doesn't seem very schooly at all, though, does it? I'm not sure what you mean by that. I mean, this floor's atmosphere is completely different. Like, it's a whole other building. Making a building like this must have taken a lot of money and work. And all the research labs are amazing. How much money was put into this school? And if it was all built for just us... They did mention that the labs were, were so that we could develop our talent. You research your talent, perfect it. That's kind of like a school, isn't it? Then Monokuma really wants this to be a school where our ultimates gather? And yet, at the same time, they're trapping us here and making us kill each other. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. We were brought here and then forced to do the killing game. Um, I don't understand it at all. My plain mind has hit its limits. What on earth is this academy for gifted juveniles? I don't know. What's up, Gonta? Juveniles. This area feels spooky. Gonta scared too. <laughs> was that was that an Earthbound reference? That wasn't an Earthbound Wait, reference. What? Was, what was that another reference? I don't, I don't. He said, "Hang on, hang on." The line was, "This area feels spooky." Gonta scared too. That's that's not Earthbound, it's right? It's close. It's close, but I don't it's think it's close enough. Okay, all right, that's fair. It's okay. The murder story was just made up. Not just story. Gonta have just have weird feeling. Maybe a stain on that wall over there is blood? It is just a stain. It's probably just staged. You Wait, know? it's Jessica Chastain? Oh, just a stain, never mind. <laughs> Staged? Monokuma, or the Monocubs, probably just put it there to scare us. R r really? So oh? the script has been flipped, huh? Samugi, does this kind of stuff bother you? Well, it's not that I'm okay with it. It's just when it's so overdone like this, <laughs> it makes it seem fake. So I feel okay. It's kind okay, of come on. Sweeney Todd. Samugi, Samugi keeps repeating things that the Monocubs have said. I think that she might be the big bad guy. I think maybe. <laughs> it's Juko! <laughs> oh god, she's... <laughs> She's the ultimate cosplayer, but she's actually Junko cosplaying as some other character, also making her the ultimate cosplayer because she couldn't be detected. Ah! <laughs> and, she's and double the, ultimate. And the, and the whole thing where my skin changes color, that's just a cool trick I do. <laughs> <laughs> but Gonta, you were so reliable until just now. I guess it was too early for you to wear a tuxedo and a mask. Uh, 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 no, but tuxedo's essential for gentlemen. Oh. <laughs> we're, we're back on this. <laughs> well, you two are funny. Um, wow. What is happening I, I did here? not expect this to be the budding relationship of this chapter. <laughs> yeah, this must be a door to an ultimate lab. I wonder whose lab this is. I should look inside. Uh, Korakio? Korakio. Yep. Korakio! Yeah, there wow. we go. Okay, this is probably oh. the coolest room yet. Oh, 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 ho, 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 ho. It's almost like just, in a museum or just library. Just sit down anywhere, okay? Oh, <laughs> I like this. It's huge and a little eerie. Uh, oh, oh, this is see. incredible. There are various objects stored in shelves and ca cases. Some of them seem very rare. It would appear this is my lab. The ultimate anthropologist's lab is so wonderful. My face contorts with glee. Not even university labs are still so well stuck. It's called who brought all this stuff here? <laughs> I, I suppose there's no point thinking about it. Nothing in this place makes sense. I mean, he's not. You right? We. I guess we can't technically tell that he's smiling because his face is covered. <laughs> The zipper kind of contorts and looks like a smile <laughs> sometimes. What does with Glee look like if not smiling? <laughs> uh, hold on, let me start my face cam. <laughs> <laughs> There's a book in the display oh. case. Oh, that's impressive, fall shame. <laughs> how, do, how are you doing that with your everything? You doing, huh? No, that's just my face. Wait till you see what I can do with That's not his face. <laughs> <laughs> Did you spell the word joy with your body? <laughs> I've been working on that. Ah! 
What part of your person am I looking at? <laughs> <laughs> the bookcases were full of books, but I imagine this one is special. This one looks like it was bound by hand. <gasps> Can it truly be? Unlike his usual quiet self, Kyo shouted and ran over to me with an alarmed expression. His steady, careful hands he took I with steady, careful hands he took the big book from his showcase. Swear to God, if they make like oh, a fucking Death Note it, reference, it is. How amazing! Is actually real. Uh, what is this book, Kyo? Oh. It is an extremely precious document. This book is the history of the fabled Caged Dog Village, said to have been destroyed long ago. The Caged Dog Village? The Caged Dog Village had a reputation for using many dark arts and spells. The village was destroyed at the hands of a feudal lord who feared their power. But one girl, the lone sur survivor, or risk her life to write this book. <laughs> Which means... This is all her handwriting. This book is an extremely precious, one-of-a-kind relic that has been soaked in her bitter grudge. One-of-a-kind? Wow, that is valuable, man. <clears throat> On top of that, since this book has a reputation, there are few copies. Since I was fortunate enough to obtain one of those copies, I have already memorized it. <laughs> but they never thought I'd be able to lay eyes on the real one. What a trick of fit. Ah, uh, Kyo, what did you mean by reputation? The rumor goes that the spells and dark arts inscribed in this book are extremely potent. They surpass the comprehension of people who live in the world of science and technology. That is why it was buried in the darkness, along with the entire caged dog village. But it seems the da, yet. But it seems those were no mere rumors. I can feel power seeping out from this book. The deep-seated grudge of a girl whose village was destroyed permeates every letter. Tell me more. It's just. This is just getting weird. I think I should just probably end the conversation. Uh, no, 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 right. no, please, please, go on. Uh, he clearly had of, way more to talk about. <laughs> this book's kind of like what the... It's, it is to Sun Tzu's Art of War if the comics to create the Holy Bible. There's something what? in this case. It's a golden katana, how beautiful, I see. That's the reference. It's rusted in places, but looks about a yard long and it's still sharp. Is that really gold? It's probably valuable. Oh, this. Kehehe. <laughs> You've drawn to that katana, I see. However, it was merely coated with gold leaf. Ah, so it's not made of gold. Yet said, that katana has immense anthropological value. In certain rural areas, Katanas were used to defeat generals in wars as worshipped as gods. That is one such katana. It, it is an extremely precious relic necessary to spread. Oh. Oh. oh it, really? Wait. Yeah. Okay. Um. Which one? <laughs> Whoa, that's a super rad katana. I want to take a look, see. Neat. Oh, he's in the room now. Kicks the fucking door open. <laughs> what up, bitches? <laughs> Comes out of the coffin. <laughs> hey! <laughs> hey! Kokichi suddenly popped up from between, from between us and grabbed the katana from the case. <laughs> Wait, you mustn't touch it without... I'm gonna lick it! <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be super careful with it. Would I lie to you? Da! Kokichi, Kokichi completely ignored Kyo's warning and, she, and unsheathed the sword. Now this katana is the real deal. It's even gold-plated for that authentic look. Mmm, I see. It could also be used as... A murder weapon! That's, no! I am locking it up. <laughs> Kokichi? That is an extremely precious relic. Please do not treat it so lightly. 
or I love I love that tone he started with just like Kuki <laughs> Listen I will tear out your nerves. Yeah, but look, now there's two. Okay, I get it. Please don't make that scary threat. Kokichi slid the sword back into its sheath and and had handed it back to Kiyo. I will tie a tiny piece of string around every hair on your body and then yank Ow. them all out at once. Ow. Hot. Mm. Ew, my hands are all sticky. That gold plating flaked off too Fuck easily. It, it's just dang on rope one! Mm. Is that a problem with you? Okay. <laughs> I, I'm, I keep playing the hits. That's what they come for, okay? Sorry. <laughs> but I guess that's what makes it an authentic katana. How? <laughs> what does gold leaf peeling off have to do with katanas in general? It's just, it's really old, so the gold leaf thing is starting to like, break off. Uh, nah. It is very old, so the gold leaf comes off easily. In any event, Please do not touch things without permission. These are all precious relics. If you do so again, I will tear out your nerves. <laughs> Hurts you the first time. The scary threats really aren't necessary. So that's what Kyo sounds like when he gets angry. Uh, like a stern damn. father. A little bit. <laughs> Kyo? <laughs> I will remove you from these premises, followed by all of your internal organs oh shortly thereafter. Okay, Dad, jeez. I love those cat statues in the back. <laughs> Pretty good. So oh my god! <laughs> it's like a combo, like, luck, lucky cat, Buddha. It's a new Garfield. Key. It's Garfield. It's Garfield. There's a it's large, Garfield. There's a look. <laughs> <laughs> There's a large wooden dog statue on the pedestal. It looks pretty old. It has some kind of strange power to it. It makes me shiver just looking at it. The <laughs> odds. Oh, can it be? I never could have dreamed that this truly existed. Kyo, quivering with excitement, reached out to that peculiar dog statue and slowly removed the white fabric on the pedestal. Oh, <gasps> oh there's even a cage. This is perfect. Okay, oh, this is caged important. dog. Uh, perfect for what? What are the statue and cage for? Hehehe. <laughs> I never thought I would be able to touch the real thing in all my life. Wait, you told me about this. This is the um the cage dog willage. Did I say that right? Wheelage. Right? Wheelage. We gotcha. Wheelage. Wheelage. Duh. Today is a momentous day indeed. He's so focused that he's not even listening. Oh, I guess I was supposed to figure it out from context. <laughs> I feel as though the only thing I've learned is, th is that I've learned nothing about this lab. By the way, Shuichi, would you like to lend your ear to the voices of the dead? Sorry, what? <laughs> the Caged Dog Village documents contain many dark arts unique to that village. Of all of them, the one I find most interesting is a seance called the Caged Child. In fact, the wood... <clears throat> in fact, the wooden dog statue and iron cage over there are to be used in this very seance. <laughs> to discover it exists is surprising enough, but to actually have it before me. So, would you like to try? Yes. Well, let us converse with the dead using the caged child, shall we? And I guess to. who's going to be the caged child? I got <laughs> Bad yeah, feeling. I did not agree to this. <laughs> uh, no, no, thanks. I don't have any interest in the occult. No, no, you mustn't dismiss it as simply the occult. Some mentors you refer to it as the occult of the utmost importance to anthropology. Dismissing things you don't understand as the occult is the defilement to all cultures. Duh. Uh, yeah, Any... but talking to the dead. Haven't you ever wanted to speak with the dead? Hello. Well, now you're creeping me out. I speak with the dead. If it were possible, I suppose I'd like to talk to her one more time. No, 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 I decline. 
Even if it were possible to speak with the dead, I don't I don't have anything to say. Not yet. We only the only thing I'd want to say is we escaped. We finally got out of here. <laughs> that the toy determination uh, uh, tried, I tried to sing it but it didn't quite work out the way I was hoping it would their determination is beautiful perhaps you are correct calling on the dead out of curiosity would only be a blasphemy one must call on them only at the appropriate time Man, we got spooky up in here I felt a shiver up my spine alright well, that happened. Uh, <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> Gorokio's gonna murder some of this, this case. Um, it's packed with books and scrolls. They're all weathered and old. I don't think I could read all of these if I had a million years. Alright. Uh, anything else? Oh, what's this? Wait, back door. Door to hallway. What's the back door lead to? If you have to ask, you'll never know. Hey, -o. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, um, I think. Smoogie! Contest! Smoogie! Smoogie! Hey, you two down there? Oh, they're still there. Ruh-roh. Okay. They're Maybe actually pretty scary that, themselves. Whoa. Whoa. What the fuck? <laughs> this place keeps getting better. <laughs> yeah, oh, Smoogie and Contest look like the Whoa. twins from The Shining. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, that's that, this is This is creepy. Um, what is this? What is this? Oh, hanging scroll? What's this? It's like a hanging scroll, but it's blank. Um, yeah, they put it the sure is. Up there? The it in sure is. Oh, uh, no, it wouldn't no. prompt. Oh, it? dang. Yeah, I like the idea, though. Um, yeah. Uh, okay, take a look back and look at this place. Yeah, this is... This is oh, it's just an this arc. A, okay. There's a lot going on here. Yeah. Damn. What's with, the, what's with the strings hanging from these? <laughs> Alright, uh, anything down this way? What was that yes, door? Actually. Uh, that's a great question. What the? <laughs> Not even the game knows what that door is. <laughs> uh, I don't run there. It's the door to an ultimate lab. Uh, From the look of it, I'd say it's for. Oh, is this um Angie's? Angie's. I should... Yeah. Oh yeah. I should investigate. I forgot. Her. What's Angie's power again? Ultimate she's the sculptor. Ultimate art. But she hasn't done anything. She's just yeah. art. It's just art in general. Uh, oh. Yeah. All she's done is mention a Tua. <laughs> She goes around with a paintbrush and a chisel sometimes. I grabbed the doorknob and turned it. Click, click. Huh? Why is it locked? That's a great. Oh, hey, Kokichi. God damn it. Guess who's gonna be your partner for the rest of the chapter? Uh, I know! I know! <laughs> is it Gonta? <laughs> <laughs> yep, seems like it. I guess we can't go in. But why is it locked? The other ultimate labs weren't locked. Oh, by the way, this lab has some kind of rear entrance at the end of the hallway. But that was locked too. If both the doors are locked, how are we going to get inside? <laughs> Don't give up just yet, because I have a secret technique. Click. As if on cue, we heard the metallic click of a lock opening, and the door slowly opened. I did not oh. do that. Yaha! Can I help? Oh, Angie, you were in there. I feel weird chatting out here, so let's all go inside already, okay? Oh, jeez, how pushy. Come in, come in, please, come in. Ever polite, Angie invited us into the lab anyway. I'm okay. already inside, don't know what your guys' problem is. <laughs> Goddamn cookie <laughs> cheese. Oh. Whoa. Oh, I like it, actually. Oh, yeah. There are various. Why is all of the paint black, though? That's weird. There were various art and carving tools. Makes sense for an ultimate artist lab. But why does this lab have locks? What is it, the murder scene? Two has spoken. He says this classroom was probably made for him. For me. Uh, <laughs> for us! What does that mean? For, for all of us. <laughs> this lab is for everyone. Thank you. And that's why it has locks. <laughs> And I will answer that <clears throat> with my sexy, beautiful voice. Wait a second. We said I was going to answer that question. No, it didn't. Is your memory getting even worse, Monotabo? You promised! Because I don't remember you not promising. That doesn't make any sense. So what? Just let me do it. If you don't, I'll 
stick oh. my hand up my butt and then shove it in your mouth and rattle your molars around. What the uh, fuck? What? A mouthful of my foot in your ass? <laughs> <laughs> That looks sanitary. You're gonna get a handful of my ass in your mouth. <laughs> oh, oh wait, Monodam. But well, we weren't fighting or anything. We were just messing around, you know, because we're friends. It's fine, as long as you're getting along. So, uh, what's up with the key? Oh uh, yes, and she's the kind of girl can't focus on her art unless she's alone. I must shut out all people and noises so that I can be with the great Atua. Atua is much too shy to be with the one that's me in front of people. I'm calling it now. We're gonna get a scene where they're like, where she's like infused with his power and turns into some like big buff like version of herself, aren't we? I cannot begin to understand how this joke is supposed to make any sense whatsoever, but wow! Like a porn star! It's the opposite! <laughs> so, any room where I'm gonna make art needs to have a key, but... I'm surprised the modern cubs knew that. Huh? And these are all my favorite art supplies and sculpting tools, too! How did you know? Oh, um, what should I say? I'm not a good improviser. Calm down, I'm even worse. We know everything about you, bit, bit, yet, yeah, yasterds, yeah, because we want to be your friends. Uh -huh. I don't want to be friends with you. I'm only interested in Monokuma. I don't want to get friendly <laughs> with knockoff products. Oh my god, you're so nice to me! Thank you! <laughs> Why? Why would you say that? Why do you hate me? I won't forgive anyone who refuses to get along with me! Now, Monodem, we haven't getting given them the key to this room, have we? Okay, here it is. But there's only one key, so don't lose it. This is gonna be important for the case later. It'd be bad if you lost it. You wouldn't be able to lock the door or open it from the outside. No. Let me see that key. Monodim swiped the key from Monophony and, and, and lifted it to his mouth. Nope. Nah! What? Ah! He ate it! Nope. Ah! He swallowed it! Beep, beep, beep. Ah! He's flatlining! What are you doing? If you swallow that key, you'll definitely choke on it! Someone <laughs> might use this key for murder. Because keys <laughs> are mysterious. That's a terrible reason! <laughs> if something bad happens, it would be too late. I want everyone to get along. Oh, Mono Dam, you're so reckless. Let's carry one of them away for now. We'll carry him like a kind boss taking care of a drunk employee. Uh, okay. Alright, bye guys. Bye. Sorry about your key, Angie. <laughs> what are we ever talking about, Monophony? Do you know? <laughs> <laughs> like, ever? <laughs> So, did that mean we can't get the key? What the hell? But I'm only going to lock this door when I'm inside working, so... I don't care if I can't open or close the door from the outside. Oh, then I guess that's fine then. By the way, those guys said they know everything about us, right? That's probably why this lab fits Angie's taste so well. So does that mean this school is specifically made for us? Monokuma has claimed that before, but is that really possible? This giant complex was built just for the 16 of us? It's a miraculous mystery that only a Tua knows, but it doesn't matter. As long as it's comfortable, I'm fine. 
If our lives here become more enriched, then there's even less reason to leave this place. Whatever, I get to do what I want, so fuck y'all. Go kill each other, see if I care. <laughs> if you can believe that we're not gonna kill each other, then it seems like a pretty sweet deal. Yeah, I, I would probably uh, settle onto that. Nah, I, I don't want to go through the new the list of reasons why, regardless of whether or not we <laughs> would be killing each other, this would still be a pretty exceptionally <laughs> shitty deal. <laughs> yeah. Ah, that's true. Are we supposed to be okay with that? Thank you, Shuichi. Hi, Angie. I see, I see. There's an ESO, brushes, and all kinds of art supplies here. Sculpting tools, chisels, and a wooden hammer. What a divine collection of tools. These are all my favorites, so I can make do even if they don't have access to the deep sea. Island girls Not like do. <laughs> now that you mention it, I don't see any completed pieces in here. Just a whole lot of pure black paint stains. <laughs> I would expect an art room to have sculptures and replica paintings and other colors. I don't need references when a tour is the only one who cre creates art. From now on, this place will be filled with col my collaborations with the tour. I'm not sure if I'm entirely comfortable with your perceived relationship with this Atua character. <laughs> Oh, look, Suichi. The ceiling here is pretty unique. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Exposed beams. I wonder. You gonna say somebody's gonna hang themselves from up there? Is it supposed to be like this? Or did they not finish in time? Those cheap knockoffs are useless. Like that time they mixed up the Cubs pads. Mm -hmm. I don't care. This kind of... Bare ceiling doesn't bother me. A tumor, even what? a tumor says it's more sensitive than the skin's peeled back. Uh, 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 <laughs> anyway, I lump of wax. <laughs> What's this heap of stuff? It doesn't look like water stone. Oh, this is. Oh, we saying something? No? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, this is wax for making wax sculptures. Oh, wax sculptures, huh? You can make those, Seiji? Unlike water stone, wax is a soft texture for sculpting. Hmm. But, oh, but the two is the one who's gonna be doing the sculpting. Oh, I see. But, but, it seems like people have been making wax sculptures for a long time. In ancient times, death masks used to be made from wax. A wax death mask. Oh, that's kind of scary. Huh. Alright. Well, Kukichi, you got anything to talk about, buddy? Oh, wait. What were we just talking about? Uh, yeah, I don't care either. If it makes life here more interesting, then I'm fine with that. Should we be? Should we be, Kukichi? I don't know. Maybe we should be. Um, do you want me to look at it? Oh, front door. Um, I guess I'll leave? I guess I'll leave. This door isn't the one we used to come in. I guess I'll leave. This door is super crappy. I'm guessing this is the rear entrance. That was a pun, you dumbass. See? Mm. It's got a sliding lock just slapped on here. Oh, right, and the door that we used. Yeah, that door has a knob and a cylinder lock. Kokichi, we need to go get cameras all up in this room, like <laughs> right now. <laughs> The same classroom has two different kinds of locks for the doors. That's mildly infuriating. No, no, it's perfect that they're not the same. She must be an architect. Symmetry is Western beauty ideal. They like symmetry and the golden ratio and such. But I think asymmetry, because I'm not from the West at all, no, nope, pip, pip, cheerio. But I think <laughs> symmetry and composition functions are more beautiful. Well, I don't really get it, but I suppose that makes sense. Okay. I can't stay long. I still haven't found the flashback light. I have other places to check. Well, I better go, huh, Shuichi? So, anybody think that this room might not have a corpse in it later? Okay, anybody? well, I, there's been murder stuff in the three rooms we've seen so far. Yeah. That's true. What? Three rooms? Corkios and what? Oh, we didn't see... Oh, I, was, I guess I was thinking about the upstairs in general. Well, oh, the um, 
assassin room. Yeah. Jesus. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Neat. What the hell am I looking at? Why does this look familiar? It's like yeah. a random pile of TVs or something. Yeah, what is going I would like to know what's going on with this corner, please. Video game. All right. Oh, wait. I got <laughs> left this, room. Oh. It is a room what to is the this? left. Oh. Uh oh. Um. When no, uh, I saw that. Were we supposed I saw to that. see that? <laughs> Candles just barely lit. Just barely light a dim, dusty room. This is creepy. Hard to see, too. It seems like something like that would appear in a cult manga. There's a tragic feeling here. It really does feel like something is gonna pop out of you, like Minosuke. Minosuke, where are you at? Come on out. Hey, Smoogie. Yeah, yes, Smoogie. Even though I said all that, it seems like something's going to jump out after all. This feels like one of those old abandoned asylums full of lunatics or criminals. To the point that I'd half expect to see a corpse burst through the wall and chase us. Mm. Sorry, that's not something to joke about. Yeah, you're right, Iganta. Nothing here. What this room for, anyway? Oh, um, great question. Is there like a secret thing? Oh yeah, lit candle. Show me that. The candles on the walls are the only light in this room. There are, no, there are no windows here. It'd get pitch black if candles go out. Ah, please don't pull them out. I don't really like the dark. I can't imagine many people do. Okay. Um, I guess that's it for this room? There's nothing at all in this room except a couple candles. Okay, yeah, sure. I'll investigate a little bit more. Do we look at the monitor? There's a monitor for communicating with us. There's nothing on the screen, but just seeing it makes me feel sick. Does Smokey have something else to talk about now? We didn't say a whole lot with her. No, that doesn't. Hmm. Yes. Corp. Corp. Yes. Okay. There we go. Um. Gonta? Nothing here. What's this room for? Uh-huh. Carbon Quark says the floor arc. The whole floor. The oh, okay, yeah. The floor. These floorboards seem feel a bit unstable. Oh, this floorboard got no nails in it. <clears throat> oh, really? Yeah, floorboard just resting on top of cross piece. I suppose it's not just my imagination. But each floorboard is thick and they got no gaps between them, so it'd look okay. Gone to not worried about falling through floor all of a sudden. But, it's pretty dark here. It's a little hard to see where we're stepping. Hmm. And, in the corner, there's a hole in the floor. So it might not be good to go over there. We should get out of this room. There doesn't seem to be anything else of interest in this room. It doesn't look like there's anything... If anything important here. Just an empty room. Oh, it's not only empty room. You see three same-looking doors and hall, right? All those rooms empty, just like this one. And they only got candles for light, too. Ah, so there are three of them. Anyway, we no gotta worry. No reason we ever need to use empty room like this. True. Then, can we leave soon? The darkness and the shaky floor are making me nervous. It's only a matter of time before the shutter bursts open and a newspaper gets blown in. What are you talking about? But there I are no references. I don't know. <laughs> I don't have any reason to waste time in an empty room. All right. Yeah, let's leave then. Yes. And I believe that there was another room on my left. I think. Right? This one. Right room. Is this gonna be the exact same thing? Oh. You fiend. I see, this is exactly like the other room. Uh-huh. Let me look at the floor of this room, too. It's really dim, so it's difficult to move around. I can see a gap in the corner. I should be careful. Okay. Lit candle. The only candles... The candles on the wall are the only light in the room. Okay, so this is I, this room's identical to the other room. 
Yeah, okay. Kind of kind of weird. Kind of weird. But okay. Actually, can you go back in there and click on the floor, please? You want me to click on the floor again? Sure. Yeah. Well, you didn't click on the floor in this room, did you? Yeah, I did. Oh, sorry. I missed it. My bad. That's okay. I'll just leave then. Yes, I would like to leave. Okay, so where am I taking this golden hammer and scroll thing? I think maybe I want to go to that ninja out in the courtyard for the scroll. Um, hang on. Let me see if I already got everything on this floor. Can I teleport? Oops. What do we got out here? Oh, yeah. Looks like there's stuff going on out there. Um, we'll go right here. That's about as close as we can get. So, you like bugs? No. Uh, you like anime? <laughs> no. <laughs> Man, you two are getting along so well. That's great. So, there are a few bugs, huh? <laughs> no. There are fewer plants than before. Maintenance must be progressing well. Go ahead. It's becoming more and more beautiful, just like I'm me. Here too. <laughs> oh, shut up, Himiko. What are you trying to say? Oh, you just made Himiko angry. Someone like you wouldn't know this, but this is Himiko when she's mad. Seriously, please get her away from me, please. <laughs> it's been a week, please. <laughs> what? From your own compliment? Uh, Himiko, your expression doesn't change much, but I can tell that you really want to get away from here. Changing expressions is a pain. That's the only reason you don't do it? Gosh, Himiko! I can't I'm, I'm not very express. I'm not that good at transputation magic. <laughs> uh Okay, so does the scroll go to the ninja? Is that what we're alluding to right now? Tank up? Oh, well, gee, now I wonder. How you do? Uh, yes, ninja scroll, please. I just stuck it in his mouth. What, what is happening? Um. Welcome! It grew what the hell another is that? building. Is it a bathhouse? Is that what it is? Is it a bathhouse? It might be. Building? What kind of technology makes a building suddenly appear? Hi oh, yeah! Oh. It's not just any building, it's a dojo! So it oh. doesn't matter how it appeared. So it's her ultimate lap, gotcha. Like, I wouldn't care if a chef came by a car or train, as long as they made me good food. Is that really the same? Really, Tanko? Come on now. Well, I mean, it kind of seems like Himiko's choosing to hang out with her now. Hey, Tanko. Tenko? Sorry, I was looking at this image, trying to figure out how that thing on the back of her head is attached. <laughs> a nail. <laughs> like Eeyore? A dojo! <laughs> no school is complete without a dojo! Now let's go already! Let's go, Joe. Oh, uh, Shuichi, you can decline. I'm actually, I'd actually prefer it since you're a, a degenerate and all. Wow! wow. Like, you, you, All right. You can chill if you want, I guess. It's I, not I a big see. deal. What, so, like, if I get to the end of with of all of your events, do you still you still think of me as like a degenerate? Really, really. Even at this point. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Amigo. <laughs> this is uh, my magic too. Shut up. Oh uh, no, I used an item on the statue. It. 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 Um. It. <laughs> He seemed to be a bit confused. Uh, it was my magic. Yeah, 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 you're right. You're Your right. final like, conversation with her is just like hanging out in the cafeteria and checking out other girls. <laughs> <laughs> and she's totally down for it. Oh, yeah, she's like, dude, there's one like hang out and people watch. Be <laughs> lecherous. <laughs> Why don't you just like, you know, people watch? <laughs> Um, I'm curious as to what your definition of that is, but yes, <laughs> it make it must be an ult. Yes, <laughs> it must be an ultimate research lab, and from the look of the building, oh, it's the ultimate Aikido Masters lab. I'm sure of it. 
I was reading the chat, St. Dindin says, these two are insufferable and they honestly deserve each other. <laughs> this you is true. does not deserve that. <laughs> Alright, let's go inside. Don't be shy, Himiko. Ladies first. Mm, yeah, no, what a pain. Pushing Himiko along, Tenko steps into the building. Help! I think I'm trying to. I suppose <laughs> I should check out the side too. Like, I think you want help, but... <laughs> Oh. Oh, <laughs> the giant Moko Jin in the back. Hi, Moko Jin. What the fuck? That's Tekken! Look at all these Moko Jin. <laughs> Whoa, this is a huge dojo. That's the Tommy Mats on you. <laughs> Smell nice. <laughs> what the fuck is punch, going punch, on? Punch, what punch, the jeez? Look at them punching. Why do you have a... Why do you have a bottomless pit <laughs> in your room, Tenko? If you get wrung Jesus. out, you die. Oh, no, this puzzle. I guess. You can chain. This is scaffold supported in the air with chains. Is this for some kind of jump training? It's like a kung fu movie. This All right. Hey, oh, oh giant wooden doll. What is this? It's a large doll made of wood. Oh wait, is it a doll? Is it supposed to watch over us and protect us? I don't know. But Tenko, what's up? Oh, I so want that thing to fight the uh, the the, the mono mecha, whatever they're called. <laughs> King mono Kim. Kuma. No, no, like the. Uh, the, like the Metal Gear things. Oh, the Exosols. Oh, Exosols, yeah. yeah. See, this is my lab, you jerk! I'm not sure why you thought I didn't want it to be. <laughs> I'm so happy! I just can't contain my emotions. I'm like an excited dog that just pees everywhere. <laughs> I could literally pee right now. You said it, not me. <laughs> yeah, I said it. What are you going to do about it? Wow, this is such a nice dojo. I'm sure sparring will be incredible here. But, uh, uh without a... But without, nope, nope. But without a sparring partner. Oh, oh my god! Oh, yeah. Ow! <laughs> what was that the for? The human arm should oh. not bend that way. Oh, 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 why are you throwing me? Neo Aikido was a super serial martial art. Instead of training, we just fight head on. Now, Hamiko, aim for the heart. You're gonna start with that? <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is just kidding? Why did we go straight into actual fight? Oh, God. You don't have a lot of confidence in yourself, do you, Shuichi? Sorry, what? You lack self esteem. And because of that, you doubt your strength. Positive reinforcement out of nowhere. You seem more confident than before, but I can tell you still question yourself. Well, I'm right, aren't I? I can tell when my sparring partner is burdened by doubt. Um, you might be right. You know what works real good at lifting all that doubt? Neo Aikido. Because Aikido itself is a Japanese martial art that treasures a pure heart above all else. So how about you, Himiko? How about yeah. you, Himiko? N <laughs> Fucking like, how about you, Himiko? And then it cuts over to her and she's just like cross-eyed drooling in a corner. <laughs> <laughs> if we combine your magic with my Neo Aikido, then we'd be able to solve things by force. By force? I thought this was about being pure of heart. Neo, I don't want to do any exercise. It's too much of a... <laughs> Slam! Please stop Aikido throwing everyone in the room. You know, Danganronpa, you had an opportunity there and you didn't take it. I'm proud of you. <laughs> I see. It seems you are still too shy to show your emotions, Amigo. What a waste. You have the richest heart of all. You should do Neo Aikido, Himiko. Training your body will help you express your emotions. Now, come sweat with me. Come on and sweat on your friends. And I feel like I'm turning you into a ghost frog with my magic right now. Do it. Oh, you're angry. I can see it in your heart. Even I can see that. Do it, do it, do it, Himiko! Hey, Himiko, what's up? My back hurts. If you do that again, I'll definitely turn you into a gross frog. Right now, 
I have to use all my magic to fix my back. I can fix can get, that. Can I you love, get mine too? I love how her like argument was basically, you should take Neo Aikido. Result, we shower together. <laughs> <laughs> the tatami mats are new. They smell, they smell nice, I guess. All right. <laughs> Let's all get naked and wash each other. <laughs> <laughs> That fucking da oh balance pole. Yes, hits. Is this a pillar? Why is there a pillar here? I could e I could ask <laughs> I could ask the ultimate Aikido user. No, all right. Suspended scaffold. I don't feel like he's like. There's a scaffold suspended in the air with chains. Is this for some kind of jump training? It's like a kung fu movie. Come on and slam. And welcome to jump. Welcome to the gym. <laughs> uh. More I once saw a sign. I think it was in a Japanese airport, and it said, "Come on and slam and welcome to Japan." God <laughs> damn it! <laughs> just about the greatest thing thing I've ever seen. Can I leave? <laughs> Can, yes. I'm sure Tenko would appreciate it. Yeah, just leave me alone with Miko over here. Yeah, <laughs> well, Please stop! I, she's throwing me again. Hey girl. <laughs> I could. You know, I've throw suddenly you down decided I don't again. care. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> hmm? What's that over there? Oh. Hey, me. Come on. What's the big deal? I can't hold back any longer. Um. What? No, no. It's it's too soon. I'm not ready for that. He um. is. You see, chat. The innuendo here is that she's an inventor, <laughs> and yeah. he's a robot. Yes. And uh, and she yep. probably wants to take him apart. But we're being I, led I, I, to believe. Yeah. You're, These are you're her lascivious attitude. You're ignoring the very, very possible reality that it is a single entendre. <laughs> and <laughs> what's happening is exactly what it looks like. He wants the robot. Can you fuck it? <laughs> Chad is already saying, oh, this scene. <laughs> Alright. Oh, no. Hey, if you think we're going to want to skip it, let us know ahead of time. <laughs> I won't make things worse. And you'll probably feel a lot better. We can take this relationship <laughs> to the next level. Please. But me, you. We oh, should. he's blushing. It'll be fine. Just come with me. We'll do it together. Puller and Kiba's arm. Mio made her way to the ultimate inventor lab. What was that? I feel like I just saw something I wasn't supposed to see. I should check to see what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> Are you too. Well, are you too fucking? Least, I should stop in and say hi. We are going. Are you too? Are you too fucking? Did somebody? <laughs> did somebody order a big sausage pizza? <laughs> Careful not to make a sound. I open the door no. and I peek yes. inside. Somebody. <laughs> I heard a strange sound. When I looked for the source of the sound, my eyes were met with an unbelievable oh sight. God. Um. Oh. God damn it. Um. The single entendre. <laughs> Uh, there's a print screen button here somewhere. Hold on. Okay, oh. found it. Her ass is twice as high as her breasts. <laughs> Where is her spine in this scene? That's the it's in chemo. <laughs> Man, you're really plugged up. You're practically throbbing. Ugh. Throbbing with uh. dust and debris, that is. Mm -hmm. mm, this is no good. Ugh. No good at all. You must feel so pent up. No. I apologize. I've been neglecting my needs ever since I got here. <laughs> Relax. I'll get it all out. Trust no. me, you'll feel much better afterwards. No. Oh, um, thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah, your chassis is firm. Really firm. <laughs> like, damn! Your body's seriously incredible. I've never seen one like this. Be careful. Be gentle. That tickles. This is amazing. Whoever put you together definitely knew what they were doing. I feel all tingly. Yes. <laughs> if, if, if this evolved into a, like, an actual sex scene on camera, like... <laughs> Who would give out first? Ball chain, me, or R coupling over the stop streaming button? God <laughs> damn it! Definitely not me, boys! Let's keep going! Uh, yeah, the time and a place where we should stop, and we've definitely gone past it! Let's see where the fucking there, thing goes! 
I don't, I don't think you understand. In front of us, Fall Shane, you and I are having phone sex right now. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say that line. All right, here, I'll bring it back. There it is. <laughs> you definitely don't know what you're doing to. Or what you're doing to? You definitely know, you what, definitely you're doing. know what you're doing to. Oh, you definitely know what you're doing, too. If you keep this up, I might just... Whoa! <laughs> so that's the sound you make when I touch that spot. Good to know. Anyway, I'm just, I'm just gonna shut the door behind me. <laughs> Close the door behind me! <laughs> <laughs> I was, I was disgusted what I saw, and after 20 minutes, I left. <laughs> Save to memory bank. Mia was just doing some maintenance on Kibo's body. That's that's what that that's was. All it was. That's, that's, that's what that was. That's, 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 that's what that was. That's what that was. Nothing but what. That. that is what that was. Um. They didn't anyway. even explain that they weren't having sex. It didn't even explain that. Um. Where else would you? Oh right, I need to figure out what to do with the fucking. Um... How else <laughs> would I know? Go back. They're, they're saying not... go back. They're saying go, go back. Go back to the door. Yeah, no. Examine it again. No. All right. No. Trust the chat We're doing this one. because you sell us to do this, okay, chat? All right, this is on you, chat. Mio is doing some maintenance on Kibo's body and <laughs> nothing else. <laughs> okay. All right, map. Um, oh, I thought we were gonna get another scene. I'm glad we no. didn't. No. Uh. Well, Kaido's hanging out over here. Kaido? Oh, Kaido's still hanging out in the ultimate um assassin's lab. Uh. Shit. Where else would I go right now? To use a golden hammer on something? Huh. I don't know where like half of the characters are right now. Whose room haven't we seen yet? Uh, quite a lot of them, I think. Yeah, we haven't, we seen, haven't seen. Haven't seen mine. We haven't That's... seen Kibo's room. Yeah. Um. Or or have we? Oh wait. Because I remember him bragging about his dad. Bragging about his. Oh yeah. Oh uh, no, that, that was just a that was just a free time conversation. Yeah. That wasn't a lap. <clears throat> uh. Hi. We, ha Jesus. we haven't seen some movies. Uh, oh. Ah! 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 What are you doing here? What are you ah! doing here? Oh. Monokuma stared at me in silence and then disappeared down the hallway. What? I suppose he wants me to follow him. What could be down there? What? You want me to follow Monokuma right now? What's going yes. on? Follow the go? dying bear. <laughs> the dying bear. Um. Where'd he go? Did he actually want me to follow him somewhere? No? I'm confused. Hang on. I'm gonna go talk to Samugi and Kanta. They'll have the answers for me. They haven't let me down yet. Except Samugi constantly. <laughs> hey. What on earth is this academy for gifted juveniles? I don't know, but you apparently are just repeating dialogue. Do you- Oh, hey, buddy. What's going on? <laughs> you know. Get down there. Mon- Monokuma is glancing back and forth at me- At me and the picture on the wall. Is he trying to be helpful? Huh? This picture. Huh. Oh, I see. It's not a canvas. It's a pane of glass. Perhaps... Maybe I shouldn't- I should use that item I haven't used yet on this. Alright, it's worth a try. I held the hammer in my f in my hand, faced the glass in front of me, and threw it as hard as I could. All right, well, definitely wasn't expecting this. Oh, okay. So who's going to sure. clean up this glass? Karim. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Just as I thought, there's a hidden passageway here. Now. Yeah. Are you dying? What's going on? I don't know what he's up to, but this ri did really help us out. Guess the passageway looks different for, than the than the haunted house. More like a factory. This is eerie in a different way. It's just fucking TVs littering the floor everywhere. What the hell is going on? Um. Oh. Oh, this has got to be Kibo's room then. It's gotta be. He's gonna need to zip up and get over here real fast. 
Yeah, it's a giant Xbox. It does look a lot like an Xbox. It's a giant machine. I've never seen this before. What 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 could this Oh. Ah, uh, hey guys. If you've come this far, that means you solved the painting puzzle. Excellent teamwork. Huh? What teamwork? It's just Suichi. That puzzle was too difficult for one person to solve. I'm sure they got along and solved it together. Let's just play along. He'll put ourselves in danger if we defy him. It's true what they say. The serious ones are the scariest when they finally snap. I'm certain it's not possible. But did that outdated piece of junk help you at all? You better wait until I'm I'm not having an existential crisis, young man. You. Oh yeah, we should explain this room. So this is the computer room. Computer room. But this computer isn't just some ordinary computer. This computer you're looking at is like super amazing. Is this like Kibo's mainframe or something? If I remember correctly. Oh. It's so amazing that you can even use it to create a new oh, world. Oh. A new... What was with the way that you pronounced that word? A nothing, a I said world? a new world, sorry. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, a, a new world. A new world. You can use this to create a new world. I mean... Wait. <laughs> we were supposed to tell him... Were we supposed to tell him that? I've already forgotten the plan. You totally said way too much. Ah, I knew it! You're so forgetful, Matata. You gotta try to remember what you can and can't say. Sorry. Why didn't you help him, Monothony? Huh? The next has been chosen. When you realized he was saying <laughs> too much, you could have helped him, right? So why didn't you? Your friends, right? So why didn't you help him? Why is this on me? Uh, well, uh, well, well, Jeez, um, Monopony, you really should have been there for me. Exactly. If you can't get along, you will be punished. You too, Monotaro. Friends share everything, even punishments. What? I should probably intervene at this point. Santa, this dad! <laughs> <laughs> I love you, bye. <laughs> well, I mean, I mean, they told me I wasn't allowed anymore, so I guess they're all just gonna die. This machine, they, they, this machine could make a new world. What are they talking about? Oh. I'm no good at computers. I don't think I'd understand it, no matter how much I investigate. So you're telling me not to, cause I'm gonna. <laughs> There's a giant green computer in the middle of the room. This machine can make a new world. What could that mean? What, with how little I know about computers, I don't think I stand a chance. I guess I have no choice but to leave it be for now. Well, shit, I thought this was going to be Kibo's lab. Oh, hello. Treasure chest. Oh. Ah, treasure chest. I opened the chest eagerly and... <laughs> short Sorry, one. I didn't... I didn't wait for you. I found one. I found, I found the flashback light! Da 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 I excuse me, I am beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. I respect that. <laughs> yeah, you you you're kind of pretty too. I respect in a way, your I right guess. to believe that about yourself. <laughs> Kukichi, we're both kind of pretty, you know, right? Right? No. Right. Step <laughs> off. Like I don't already have fifty million people telling me how beautiful I am every day. I don't need your pathetic ass. All right, I take it back. Damn straight, you do. I'll get the what others. The you just bring. <laughs> well, help off I go. See ya. 
Okay. I wonder how much of an actual little shit Kiba or um, Kokichi is, and how much he's definitely I, supposed like, to be a terrible person. Breathe oh, more true. into it. Yeah, he left. Okay. Uh, You're just distilling now... him into his true essence. <laughs> <laughs> a terrible little shit. That's true. I'm really good I'm at leaving. bringing out the worst in everybody. Hmm. So was that supposed to be like a whole bunch of like voting podiums, like the end of NDR, or rather DR2? Hmm. Like how they interfaced with the, whatever it was called, the Matrix. What, with that thing, that, that thing that we can't quite remember the name of, yeah. Yeah, you're right. The Matrix. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, what are we gonna learn this time? I'm gonna guess that it's probably not gonna be good. We weren't exactly happy with what we figured out last time. No, oh, oh shh, she heads to the dining hall. Yes, that was the plan. Thank you for stopping me. My god, an appreciated invisible wall. In a video game, can't be true. Alrighty, heading over to the dining hall, which I believe is... This way, yes. Yes, we're good. Alrighty. Ooh, oh, party. Goodness. Are these all that's left? I think so. Suichi. Yeah. Hey, Suichi, I'm in a good mood today. Is it uh. true that you found another flashback? Uh, <clears throat> yes, it's true. You do look like you're in a good mood, Kibo. It's great. Wait, so Kikichi wasn't lying? I'm stunned, startled, shocked. See? I told you I wasn't lying. Good thing, too, because I don't want my pants on fire. I want to start talking about what we're going to do, but Kaito isn't here yet. Uh-oh. Maki's not here either. Uh-oh. Oh, Maki's not coming. I, uh, didn't invite her. Huh? You didn't invite her? Scratches off list. Have Maki kill Kaito. Forget about that killer. Hey, Miyu, Keyboy, do you guys need the computer room on the fourth floor? Computer room, you say? Go on. Yeah, there was a big computer on the fourth floor. Would you take a look later? You or Kibo might know something about it, right? I'm sorry, I'm not very computer savvy. Kibo, what do you do? <laughs> I am the ultimate robot. Right, but what do you do? <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, is that so? That's unexpected. I have been meaning to ask, but Kibo, what is your talent exactly? Well, I can do all sorts of things. Oh yes. I'm pretty good at one-man comedy shows, if I do say so myself. Keyboy's existence is the only ultimate thing about him. Other than that, he's got no talent. I just told you I'm good at one-man comedy shows. I've got a great one on Twitter called 90 Seconds in Heaven that you can watch every Monday. <laughs> It's when I generate a word at random and discuss it with my remaining time. <laughs> That's at the real Ryu Chan. <laughs> cut, cut. We said we weren't going to advertise that in the game. <laughs> it's good. It's good. <laughs> Leave it in. It's funny. God damn it. Can I do my line? <laughs> no, you may not. I'll go back to fucking acting out that last scene. Anyway. Jeez. I don't really get it, but we just need to check out this computer room, right? But I'm not gonna check. Yeah. But I'm not gonna come just for some computer. Nyak, nyak. It's just gonna take way more than that. Oh, well, the Monocubs did say it was amazing, probably. Oh, hey! Thanks for waiting, everybody. <laughs> oh, I brought damn, Maki. Both alive. Kaido and 
Oh, no. Oh, Who Alex you? Vertigo just subscribed with a, an emote that I've never seen before. Thank you very much for doing that. Hey! Sure what, thank you very much for doing that. Oh, Neo. Neo. Maki, why is Maki with you? Well, this is about the flashback light, so everyone should be here, right? Yeah? But when you say everyone, you truly need to include a professional killer. Oh. Ugh, I'm leaving. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. hey, hold, hold on a sec. Kaido gripped Maki's arm before she could leave. Kaido, didn't you say you wanted to take down her mask or whatever? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna take down her mask as a murderer. Sorry, what? I just can't believe a girl like her is capable of killing people in cold blood. No. Um, is it true? Are you really the ultimate assassin, Maki? I mean, I've done some wet work before. Gross. So you've killed before? <laughs> yes. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. Why? I like you hide that. What? I like how I like how Shuichi mm. talked and his sprite that's like mostly off to the side actually moved. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it obvious? It's so she could kill us all before we figured out her identity. You're wrong. It's because I knew you guys would react this way. This face is confusing to me. It really does look like she's crossing her eyes and blowing bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> like, really, what am I supposed to think she's doing right there? Okay. What? This is a, uh, when people <laughs> learn my ultimate, they get the same fear in their eyes that you all have. Eventually, that fear will turn into hate. Hate, hate will turn turns into, into anger. Anger, yep. <laughs> into suffering. And then someone will try to kill me because they're afraid I'll kill them first. Oh, no, that's, that's not... Whenever someone learns my real identity, they try to kill me. It happens every time, always. God damn it. Well, you... you damn. You're still alive. You're doing pretty good. Well, yeah, she's what's my talent assassin. again? <laughs> yeah. If anybody tries to kill her, she just has to beat them to the punch. Hmm. You've lived a pretty sad life, Maki. Shut up. Oh, poor, poor Maki. I feel so sorry for you. I think I'm about to cry. Because of everything you've been through, human life has no value to you now. Is that it? Shut up. Okay, hang on. She's in a s hang on yeah. a second. In, in the last game, DR2, wasn't there also a chapter where someone got shunned and uninvited to all the things? I don't remember who. Gundam? I, Gundam I don't kind of did. I, I just remember that there was someone that we didn't trust anymore, and so we didn't allow them to come to any of the meetings. And we were... That would be Nagito. <laughs> okay, well. I... Oh, yeah, because he went crazy. Yeah. We didn't let him come. More like we locked him up and left him in a shed. <laughs> She's an assassin, not some murderous fiend. Even if she did kill someone, that doesn't mean she thinks it's okay to. Hey, can you let go of me now? Oh, 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 oh. Kaido finally, <clears throat> Kaido finally let go of her arm and Maki let out a sigh. I knew you wouldn't believe me. That's why I kept it a secret and tried to avoid you guys as much as I could. But someone who doesn't know how to mind his business kept dragging me places. Huh? You talking about me? However, I'll say this. I have no intention of killing any of you. Unless one of you tries to kill me first. <laughs> Having said that, you probably won't believe me anyway. So, you guys mind your business, I'll mind mine, and we'll all agree to avoid each other. Just... Please, just pretend I'm not even here. <clears throat> Damn. Maki. Started out as a threat, but the last bit seemed a little sad. <sighs> Jeez, Kaido, what were you thinking? Are you trying to turn us against each other? How is this? Yes, going? everybody dogpile on Kokichi! <laughs> <laughs> I think I speak for everyone when I say we're all disappointed in you. Right, guy? Mm, no. <laughs> 
Nope. No. No, we're pretty okay no, with Kyle, actually. I, no. I wouldn't say that, but... I, right, guys? Elbows, Dante. <laughs> so, <laughs> now we finally get started. We've all gathered here for the flashback light, duh? Yes. So, have we all decided what we're going to do? We should probably... Somebody should probably tell Maki what we're doing so she can... She probably wants in on this, right? Use it, of course. We might be able to remember something new. So, could, couldn't they all just, like, stand in a, in a row and, like, hold the flashback light, like, far away and, like, flash it into all of their eyes? I, I still don't understand why we only used it once last time. <laughs> <laughs> like the true purpose of the ultimate hunt. Well, we don't know for sure if it's got anything to do with why we're trapped here. Don't give me that wishy-washy bullshit! Of course it's got something to do with why! Hey, instead of arguing, it'd be way faster if you just used it, you know? Yeah, gone to worry, but we gotta do it. I think I fucking remember what I was trying to remember. I, DR1, yeah. I think there was a chapter where Byakia forbid Kyoko from attending the meetings. Or maybe it wasn't. Yeah, that yeah that happened. That was in the fourth chapter. Okay, why did why did she get banned? Because he thought that she was the traitor. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Uh, anyway. But but no matter what we remember, you can't think about wanting to leave this place. If you think like that, we'll just be repeating ourselves. Man, that's ominous. I know that, and we can't go around repeating ourselves. D um. <laughs> Don't let's... think about it too much. <laughs> let's give it a try. Soichi, go for it. Um, I'm a little nervous. I'm <laughs> sort of just plain nauseous. I'm see what I did there? <laughs> did you see what I did I... with my word? I like that. I like that. That was good. Plain. Everyone turned their eyes to me. And I flicked on the flashback light. And at that moment, once again, the world warped. The world Oh, Jesus, yep. Damn. So in me. I'm so pretty. Basic? <sighs> yeah, oh. that's me. <laughs> My consciousness went white, and somewhere in that whiteness, a scene played. Oh. Um, they were so young and talented. How could one, this two, happen? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sixteen. Are we all dead? Oh, it looked like an accident. They were running away from that group. Was it really just an accident, though? I honestly can't believe that. Oh. That was a short one. Oh! What? Sorry, wait, wait. What was that? Did I just remember my own funeral? It was mine. It was everyone's here. What? Why was I at my own funeral? What? A funeral? You too, Suichi? It will appear we all remember the same theme. But what the fuck does it mean? Mm. Why was I watching you guys' funeral? And... Uh... Oh, why was I there too? Mm. What the hell is going on? What was the funeral? But the only thing I could remember is seeing that funeral. Nothing else. Maybe we already dead? <laughs> Feel good? No way. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Jeez, this is so stupid I couldn't help but laugh. I mean, there's no way that that was our memory of our funeral. Then what was it? It was probably a memory of our school festival or something. Um, we were pulling a great prank, weren't we, guys? Have you ever just school. faked your own death to see how all your friends and family would react? Like, what they would say about you? Oh, yeah, and mm -hmm. then you're, like, in the coffin at the open casket, and then once they're done talking, you just sit up. <laughs> and then your prank. friend Chandler laughs at you. <laughs> <laughs> School festival? Yeah, it was probably a memory from a play we did for a school festival or something. I mean, isn't it obvious if you just think about it? If that funeral was real, there's no, no. way we'd still be alive. 
you know, I'm just gonna accept that. But aren't we all from different high schools? Why would we all have a school festival together? That's... We'll probably remember something else about that later. Anyway, there's no way that funeral was real. There's no mistaking that. You're right. If we think about it logically, that's clearly out of the question. Okay, good. Going to think everyone was already dead. Stop, stop saying stupid stuff. Look at me, I'm alive. Hail and hearty. Hearty, cause you got a heart on every time you see me. Ha oh. <laughs> ha, you caught me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I heard males can tell they're healthy by how hard they get in the morning. Is that true? Dang it, Rob, stop it! <laughs> <laughs> hey, stay in your lane, bitch! <laughs> Sex jokes are my territory! I'm not good with other people's dirty jokes. I have a question. Yes, yes. Do ants get morning wood? God damn it, Juan. Uh, <laughs> I thought I could trust you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, what a disappointment. Disappointment? Yeah, you know, it's true. You really can tell how healthy- This flashback light was a real letdown. We didn't find out anything about the ultimate hunt. Just some weird memory. Yeah, seriously, talk about disappointment. No, I'm talking about the memory. I'm talking about you guys. Damn, what? Oh no, it's nothing. I'm just lying again, so don't worry about it. I wish you wouldn't have said anything in the first place, Okichi. But more importantly, the, <clears throat> the memory of the funeral we saw, it can't be a memory of a real funeral. We have to learn more about this. No matter how hard I think about it, I can't wrap my head around it. Huh. After that experience, we ate a meal in the dining hall and returned to our rooms. So maybe the maybe these characters are actually dead, and something like the New World program did what Junko was planning on doing uh, and put like fake personalities into like, everybody. Why? Mm, I don't know. I feel like there's some sort kind of secret about that funeral. I can't stop thinking about it. But it's hard to deduce anything from such a short scene. I could ask Monokuma for a hint. That would help, but. I shouldn't waste my time trying to solve an unsolvable problem. I mean, I could also, I could try asking Monokuma. <laughs> I still, I still have some time left today. Maybe I'll head out, clear my head. Free, Free time. time. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Who are we going to, everybody? Who are uh, we well, going to? Our top four are still alive, so. I think that Kaido should take a break. All right. Uh, well then we've yeah. got our top three alive still. <laughs> I'm totally fine with that. Um, if, you sub, if you want to sub in like... Um, oh, hi Benji there. Benji or Korokio, I like those two as well. Yeah, I, got, I, I like Maki too. I like Maki too. Um, Maki's in there. Uh, where is everybody? Wait, wait. Uh, uh, Mio's also not a are bad we ahead? Are we ahead on anyone? Ahead on anyone. Let me check. Uh... I like all the little symbols that... that each of the labs have. Yeah. Is that where I can check? <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So Miu had two. No, no, no that had him. Miu had two? Uh-huh. Hang on. Yeah, it's at the top left. Yep, okay. Uh... Yeah, you're right. Okay, Miu can take a break then. Um, Gonta or Kibo or how many, how, how many does Kibo have? Mm -hmm. uh, Kibo? There's one. one. Let's talk to Kibo. Well, we did We mark. did also talk with him with Kaede twice. Likes 100 mm. to 240 volts. <laughs> um, let's see where Kibo is. How about that? I mean, I'd rather finish someone off than start someone new. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Not that anyone else needs to finish me off today. Hey. <laughs> hey, he went for this, it. This has been Kibo's <laughs> one-man comedy act. <laughs> <laughs> um, Kibo? Yeah, dude. Kibo? Kibo! Don't leave me alone in the spooky hall! Kibo's having free time with Miu right now. Please try again. <laughs> no. Kibo! The, the spooky Where the hall. fuck are you? <laughs> Welcome to the spooky hall. Spooky hall. Featuring Kibo, supposedly. <laughs> where the fuck? Where the fuck is he? Um, Kibo? Oh, he's probably down this way, isn't he? 
Ebo! Hi. How dare you hide from me? Hello. I feel excellent for the first time in a while. I bet you fucking do. <laughs> <laughs> My movements are on point, wouldn't you say? Absolutely, buddy. Fist pumps. <laughs> Nice! What am I supposed to- am I supposed to shake it? Or... Yeah, we can do that. There we go. Sure. I- Hardy I hand. see. You're interested in me because I'm in top form today. <laughs> Very it, well, then. I will show you my true personality. Oh god. Hot. Uh... Kibo showed me his best moves. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't tell if they were any different. So, but I'll keep that to so, myself. So Miu seemed really into this one. Hang on. <laughs> Oh, 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 my. oh, that's, oh, wow. wow, that's, that's impressive. Wow. Wow. It's collapsible. Ah, <laughs> oh, shucks. Teles Kibo and I Telescopic, you say. <laughs> is, is that, is that a vibrating function? <laughs> Kibo and I grew a little closer today. Is that thing attached to a like piston to or like... <laughs> <laughs> Okay, um, Kibo, um, please let me find something for you. I could give you this again. Uh, but you didn't seem too happy about- well, I forget what it was that you weren't too happy about <laughs> he, last he's, time. He's bittersweet about anything we give him. Fuck, I should've saved. If it- Thanks. If it says robot in the last word of the description, give it that, that one. Okay. Um, imaginary weapon is powerful, but you only- uh, only the worthy may fire it. Embrace it to fill a man's fantasy. You could give it away, but something good might f happen if you keep it. Is this thing like the man's nut? Oh, is it? It might be the man's nut of what's, this game. What's it called? Well, it's the, the man's nut. The man's oh, nut. this thing? The gun of man's passion. Oh, yeah, that does sound like a man's nut situation. It does. It does. It does. Um, I don't know what to give. Oh, fuck it, I'm gonna give you the spare parts thing. Here, take it. Please, please accept. This is quite practical. Thank you. Yeah. Please don't get the wrong impression. I'm happy because this gift is so practical. Under different circumstances, this gift could be considered nephrophobia. So you've come to talk to me again. You must be very fascinated by me, Suichi. That is understandable. In all the world, there is no other robot as impressive as I am. Why does he talk to me like that? Although I suppose it's, it is true that his technology is pretty amazing, very human-like. Hey Kibo, you said your father is Professor Itabashi, right? Do you know why he made you? The professor told me that I am the sum total of his research. The entirety of his knowledge, technology, and expertise in the field of robotic engineering all applied to create a robot more human than any that has come before. That is what I am. He said, I am the culmination of his life's work. But I was not truly born until an incident occurred that the professor did not predict. I swear to God, if you Powerpuff Girls at me right now. <laughs> My strong idea, I, I, what? Hang on. It my strong AI was programmed such that my mental age would reflect my appearance. But unlike now, my AI was only capable of displaying a very narrow spectrum of human emotion. In response, the professor treated me the way a father would treat his son. But things did not improve. Mm. One day, a few years later, an accident occurred during a routine experiment. My programming went rogue and I ended up seriously injuring the professor. Mm -hmm. Whoa, what? Fortunately, the professor survived his injury, but I died that day. D Whoa, died? I'm a ghost robot. Oh. When I heard the professor, I was overcome by the emotion response known as sadness. <laughs> Have you heard of it? No. <laughs> the first law of robotic states a robot must not harm a human being. <laughs> Though I wasn't really punished for violating the rule, nevertheless I felt sadness. Is it anything like brooding? Because I know that. <laughs> I blame myself for hurting my father. In doing so, I was overcome with guilt. 
Now I know you oh. know that one. What? This is what it feels like to have human emotions. Okay. At that moment, my AI suddenly reset, and I became not unlike a newborn infant. Hmm. I see, so that's what he means by died. Perhaps I simply wanted to be reborn as the professor's son again. That's what the professor concluded. And he raised me as his own child. Oh, you. To tell you the truth, my memories were deleted when my AI reset. So I learned all of this secondhand from the professor himself. I had no idea he would experience something so incredible. Me either. Suichi, is something wrong? Oh, well, how do I put this? I was just thinking, man, you really are the ultimate robot, I dude. I was just thinking the same thing. Right? Right? To Professor Idibashi, Kibo is more than just a robot. And I'm sure that for Kibo, the professor is... What does that mean? Do you hold me in contempt now because I am a robot? How rude. Please reconsider your attitude towards me in the future. <laughs> yeah, you got it, Kibo. Man, I'm terrible, aren't I? I'm just such a piece of shit for the way that I, t I insinuated probably something. I don't know. I listened to Kibo's story about the professor who returned to my room. Kibo. You're a little boring, dude. <laughs> just a little bit. Oh, only one? Okay, ding dong, bang bong. Oh, oh that's cute. Oh. What? <laughs> you didn't think This nothing. is an official oh, announcement, announcement from the Ultimate <laughs> Academy. It is now 10 p.m. It's Betty Bye time for us. You two should sleep together in one big bed. Um. Oh, the three of us could all sleep in one big bed, right? As close as we are, not only could we sleep in one big bed, we could sleep in triple bunk beds. Now I'm all on board, let's yes. go. <laughs> huh? But whoever's in the top bunk might fall out and die. Uh, I've never put that close. Bedtime, Bedtime Why was I there? <laughs> <laughs> Nighttime, I have training with Kaido. We haven't done it for a while because of the murder, but we're gonna do it tonight, right? In that case, I need to go to the courtyard. Nah, Kaido's gonna be dead. He's gonna be dead. He's gonna be dead, it's gonna be all my fault. Oh, hey, Angie. Hey, what's up? What the fuck are you doing here? Huh? So, Angie? Where are you going? Oh, uh, nowhere in particular. What about you, Angie? Oh, I was just talking to the others. Talking? Since they can't hear Tua's voice, I was explaining his wisdom to them. Oh, you know how I much see. they love that. <laughs> Tua was touched by everyone's feelings, so he said we must all preserve the peace here. <laughs> I'm so relieved! I'll work with everyone to make this academy a paradise! She'll work with everyone? I wonder what she means by that. Bye, Anora Suichi! See you tomorrow! So we're definitely sticking with that vineyard catchphrase, uh, huh? Guy, okay. hey guys, can we take a quick break? Sounds oh, good. Yeah, to me. yeah, we could totally do that. Alright, folks, you. we'll be back in just a moment. After these messages, we'll be right back. Boop.
We back. We back and we're ready for more. I have a bad feeling about this. Himiko's magic show was Angie's idea as well. What is she planning this time? Huh? What are you, what are you thinking, Angie? What are you thinking? Uh, I think an Angie. Often I'm not. not. <laughs> what was that, Wonder? Are we thinking that Angie's the mastermind? Mm, I don't know about that. It looks like Kaido isn't here yet. Then suddenly... Mm. Hey, sorry I was late. I had trouble bringing her. Oh. Her. Well, gee, I wonder who you Is mean. Maki? Hey, Yay! Maki. Hey! No. <laughs> Maki? Why is Maki here? That's what I'd like to know. Someone kept buzzing in my intercom, and I got so fed up, I finally opened the door. And this guy grabbed my arm and dragged me all the way here. Well, don't worry about the small stuff. If we're gonna train, it's more fun with three people than two, right? Training? The three of us? Is that really the reason you dragged me here? This is stupid. I'm going back. Ha! <laughs> you calling me stupid again? Listen up, when I hear us to fight with a big enemy, they train, train, and train some more. That's what this training is. It's important for a hero like me. Classic so you Maki guys... always calling me stupid. Oh, I... <laughs> you stinker. <laughs> so you guys could be like super dog, cat, or horse by my side to help me be a hero. I like... We were just, well... we were just talking about them. <laughs> <laughs> what were you saying, Rip? That I like Kaido. I like Kaido. Kaido Kaido's cool. I like He's him. growing on me. Of all the examples you could have picked. Do you really think that crazy explanation about Crypto, Streaky, and Comet would convince me to stay? What the hell did you say to <laughs> You know, Crypto the Super Dog, Streaky the Super Cat, and Comet the Super Horse. We were just gotcha. talking about them a couple streams ago. Yeah, you're right, you're right. <laughs> this is still stupid, I'm going back. Hey, hold on a sec. When I said I was the hero, that was just from my perspective, you know? Even super pets think of themselves as heroes. The same goes to both of you. Each of you are the heroes of your own stories. Everyone so act more like a it. hero in their, in their own, own way. way. Hey, that's like the only musical we all know. Haha, <laughs> 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 no, I haven't seen it. I don't know. What? Re okay. Really? Know. Well, okay, what was that? We're fixing that at some point. Wait, what was it? Oh, Dr. it was Dr. Horrible? Yeah. Oh, it was Dr. Horrible. You're right. Fuck. Okay. I should have known that. Okay. Yep. <laughs> I don't know what you're up to, but I told you both to stay away from me. You know this will end badly if you don't, so why are you being so difficult? How long are you going to run away? What? <laughs> Kaido <laughs> brought his face close to Maki's. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> 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 Your mask is coming down. I could just tell by looking at you today. Should we be right. here? <laughs> so, you guys mind your business, I'll mind mine, and we'll all agree to avoid each other. Please, just pretend I'm not even here. You're not the terrifying per person that others think you are. You're just a coward. Uh... Hey, what's your enemy? Huh? My enemy? You don't need to tell me what it is, so as long as you know yourself. So how long are you going to run away from your enemy? Run away? Yeah, you've been running away. It's pretty pathetic. But if you want to stand against it, even a little, I'll train with you and you can become strong. Because you're not already strong being the ultimate assassin and all that. What? What? Oh. <laughs> Maki's getting angry. Kaido is just pr provoking her. Is, she, is he going to be okay? He's antagonizing the ultimate assassin. No. So, what are you going to do? Hey, Kaido, it's okay. You don't have to... Uh. Fine, I'll do it. Hi, ah, you're going to do it? Uh, um, don't get the wrong idea, Baka. He'll just bug me about it later if I refuse. <laughs> so you do get it. The only way to deal with idiots like him is to give up and just keep nodding. You don't get it at all. Whatever, you just get, better get ready. I won't hold back just because you're a girl. Well, what are we doing first? Alright, first 100 push-ups. I'd like to point out that she's just said idiots like him, which means that she canonically called him Baka. <laughs> yeah. 
Somehow, uh, mm, somehow, Maki ended up tr joining us, and the three of us trained together. Somehow, She's otherwise known as us. Kaito press ganging her into it. <laughs> Not bad, Shuichi. Y you're getting better. Hey, Kaito, no slacking today, yeah? I'm counting your reps. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on fire today. I can easily do 50 push-ups. <laughs> I thought we were doing 100. Hey, what about you, Maki? A hundred might be too hard for you, so... What, what, what? A, 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 a girl? Doing push-ups? What? Oh. oh my god! This has changed all what? of my preconceived notions about women in their entirety. <laughs> I, I know, right, Danganronpa? Breaking the barriers. Wait, how is she doing push-ups with her boobs in the way? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what? <laughs> Without the penis to push her up. Got <laughs> that fast. God damn it. 100, I'm done. <laughs> Maki stood Maki stood and brushed the dirt from her hands, totally composed. You're done already? You're, you're not even out of breath. I guess you've trained before, huh? I'm stronger than you. Uh, 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 oh. <laughs> Aren't you breathing a little too hard? It sounded like we really pushed ourselves. Oh my god, I love that song, absolutely. Before coming here, I did some warm-ups. I already did 500 push-ups, <laughs> okay, so... Okay, Kaido. that was the best lie you could come up with. <laughs> Seriously, bro. Anyway, I'm done, and you can't say I didn't train with you. I'm going back to my room. Okay, we're done training tomorrow, too. We're doing... No, we're done for training tomorrow, too. Good job, you went straight through the next one. <laughs> Okay, we're done. Tra we're doing training tomorrow too. There you you go. better be there. No. <laughs> All right. Maki ignored Kaido and left without a word. Jeez, I feel like we just got completely <laughs> like she just showed us up entirely. Correct. Hey, Kai Kaido, why did you do all this to help her? Huh? If someone's weak, you help them out. Teamwork's important for astronauts. If someone's weak and suffering, there's no way you can just leave them. Weak and suffering? Maki? Well, in a sense, you're... No, your 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 case is a little different. It's a little different. What, what do you mean? Oh, uh, nothing. Anyway, let's just keep going. You're still in the middle of push-ups, right? Yeah, so are you. Weren't you listening? I already did 500 push-ups before I got here. Uh-huh. Sure you did, asshole. <laughs> you're doing it too. Come on. Kaido ended up saying he didn't remember how many push-ups he did. We agreed to just start over, and we were exhausted by the time we had reached 100. That's okay, I did like 10 before, I think. What? 100 push-ups, though, not bad. It's not terrible. Uh, I was so tired. When I got back to my room, I huffed out a deep sigh and fell backwards under my bed. Kaido bring Maki. He really is crazy, but maybe it's because he's crazy that Maki came in the first place. <laughs> I just got it. Kaido, you really are something else. My eyelids closed as I continued talking to myself, and eventually I've drifted to sleep. Motto damn theater. Yeah. Oh, oh, you're the star. You're the star of Dengen Ropa nice. now, Paul Sam. Curious. Curious yes. what we mono cubs do when you're not around. I'll tell you. We listen to foreign music and laugh at the funny sounding words. When we hear words that sound perverted, we get really excited. We also wear pajamas all day and lounge in an air conditioned room. And when we all go out together, they usually make me steal. Hmm. See, we're all such good friends. We're always together. Except when they run away when I get caught stealing. Hmm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Whatever you got. Whatever you say, Monodam. I like your picture. Dang, dang, bang, bang. Fling, fling, shling, shling. <clears throat> this is an official announcement from the Ultimate Academy. It's now 8 a.m. This is an emergency announcement. Oh geez, please assemble in the gym. Refusal to get along is grounds for punishment. Oh, Mono Dam, you're really obsessed with this whole getting along thing. 
Friends is the only show he watches now. What a, I'm, if you don't get along, I won't <laughs> forgive you. That wasn't meant to be a joke. <laughs> Seriously, we've watched ten seasons. Please stop him. I will use the exosols to peel your faces off like mandarin oranges. Uh, it's so gory. Please get along, everyone. <laughs> How does it end with that uh, Ross and Rachel situation? You know what? Don't tell me. We'll get there. <laughs> oh, she puked again! Oh, it's blue this time! How rare! Ooh. <laughs> they say anyone who sees Monopoly's pew puke will have good luck! So long! Farewell! <laughs> anyway, it doesn't work out. I wonder if I could throw like a bed sheet over it or uh, assemble in the gym, Never huh? I told you life was gonna be this way. <laughs> <laughs> I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> Alright, I'm leaving. <laughs> I. I. <laughs> God, hi, Corn Keo. How you doing? Uh, good morning, Keo. Are you going to the gym? Uh, duh. I was about to head over just now. I overslept a bit today, you see. Kehehe. <laughs> of course, the one time I do that, we are all summoned, so I pancaked a bit. I am normally ready to leave my room by 7.30 a.m. That early? I usually wake up at the Monocom's announcement. I usually wake up at 6 a.m., since it takes me so long to get ready each morning. So many know, zippers. Right? So many <laughs> zippers and clasps. <laughs> Why does it take that so long? Isn't that even longer than what a girl takes? <laughs> well, Kyo does have a pretty elaborate uniform. Perhaps that's why. In any event, we've no time for idle chats. I shall go on head, head to the gym. I like how right. Danganropa in one breath is like, Hey, check out this chick totally smoking these guys in push-ups. Sexism is totally over, guys. And then in it's the next over. breath... <laughs> Isn't that longer than how much a girl takes to get ready in the morning? You're such a fucking oh. girl. I mean, you're sweet. Don't you, you know, remember, you're like, Fuyahiko opening the, the door that had a bar locking it in Chapter 3 of the last game? I hate that scene. Yeah. That scene is stupid. Oh, hey, bro. Oh, good morning. Did you hear the announcement? Yeah, we gotta meet up in the gym, right? What's going on so early in the morning? Well, I guess we got no choice but to go. You go on ahead, bro. What? You're not going? Nah, I'm going. I just gotta take care of something first, and then I'll meet you there. Kind of point kind of pointed at the door to Maki's room. Um, I suppose he's going to take her. Um, they said everybody's gotta be there, right? Who knows what'll happen if some of us don't show up. Yeah, you're right. Late, late, last night's training session and now this. Kaido's really concerned about Maki. It'd be nice if he could help her get along with everybody. Um, yeah, I guess so. Uh, can I just teleport my way over there? No, I cannot. Oh, well. I'll just head out the no door like a normal human being then. <laughs> also saw that Himiko and Samugi are somewhere? Oh, hello. Oh, goodness. Oh, God. Invite <laughs> Hey, Himiko, good morning. Yeah, Did that mean good morning? What a pain. Why do we have to go to the gym so early in the morning? I don't know, but I don't think it's anything good. We have an important student council meeting today, but this is gonna use up all my energy. An important meeting? Now, now, it's okay. You won't use up too much energy just walking to the gym. Yeah. Hey, about this meeting, are you planning something? Oh, yeah, sort of. Angie uh, said we should have a party, and you know how absolutely. those go in Dang on Rompa. <laughs> Falling. <laughs> <laughs> but you're going, right? We were planning to play in the pool where everyone else, with everyone else after this. Oh, oh yes! Do the bikini scene! This, this can only end in disaster and hilarity. Oh, Mario, horny! <laughs> <laughs> Atua said he wanted to play in the pool. 
What a peculiar request for a god to make. Can he not play in the pool if if Angie doesn't go with him? Oh no. Now's no time to be standing here talking. If we don't get out and hurry to the gym, our faces might get peeled off like mandarin oranges. I don't like mandarin oranges. Peeling off all the white stuff is a pain. <laughs> white stuff. The sand can be set about your skin. Now scoot. <laughs> the pool. Yes, the mom. Pool. So that's where all the girls will be. Oh, hi. <laughs> ah! <laughs> what? Is it, what is, do you want something? What? what? <laughs> Monokuma stared at me silently, intensely, as though he were trying to tell me something. What? What is it? If you have something to say, say it! <laughs> Suddenly a thought flashed into my mind. Man, no! no! <laughs> oh! No! Where is um, this thought going from? I'm Not gonna from be my honest, mind. I check from out, my heart. I check this out just in case it came up, and we might want to put up coin for this one. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Dragoni says, yes, my Mark, heart. say no to this. And, uh, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know if I want to. Say, say yes and put up the coin. Say yes and put up the coin. Oh. I don't know what to do! <laughs> yes, my heart, for I have love on my side. Too, yeah. too late? I understand now, Monokuma. You're telling me that it's time. The girls are going to play in the pool with me, so they'll be in their swimsuits. <laughs> that must mean a zany yet romantic scene will play out, and I'll be there! What the fuck? Yeah. This is yeah, so out I mean... of character! But should I? Is it do really okay? It. Fuck! Do Tenko would kill me! Put up, coin. Put up coin, let, let the boys see. <laughs> oh, god damn it! <laughs> Fucking fine. If you must. If you must. It, they'll, yes. get, they'll get to hear our reactions. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Hang on, I'm, I'm, keeping the I'm keeping the coin down until the um until the scene happens. Yes, I can't back down now. The power of love in my chest has, thro <laughs> has filled my throbbing heart. Full charge! I have no choice. Obviously, I must go. Uh, <laughs> this fucking okay. stupid. So stop shaking stop. the ground. <laughs> oh no! Yay! Get out of here! Shut up! Join the team, you were. Shut up! Yay! <laughs> 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 I have a bad feeling about this, but I need to go to the gym. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Not now? Did you just? I need to go to the gym. Oh, wait, what? I can't- Do I need to do it after I go to the gym? What's uh, is that what's happening? Yeah, I guess so. Do I we have to go around okay. back? Sorry, everybody. You gotta wait a minute. <laughs> Jay, you Hey, Jay, you got something Jay. you wanna say? We can't go. Yeah. Scene happens later. Okay. Hi, Kibo. Okay. Good morning. Oh, good morning, Kibo. Did you hear about the situation? Because it's a situation. <laughs> Stream parks cannot be ignored, says Jay. <laughs> so, Ouija, doesn't the summon give you an uneasy feeling? Well, well, yeah, I, I mean, I guess. Based on prior events, perhaps another motive is going to be announced. The timing is similar to when we received the Mono Cup bats. Hmm. Yes, I think that might be the case. But it's alright. No matter what kind of motive is prepared for us, we can oppose it together. Oh, what? Don't worry. We won't allow the killing game to continue. Alright, that was strange. Kivo is uncharacteristically optimistic. What did he mean by won't allow it to continue? I don't know. Uh, anybody over there? Nope. Alrighty, off to the gym then. Man, Shuichi, you do not have a very good top speed, I gotta say. You can definitely afford to hustle a little a little bit more. Oh man, I'm nervous you about this pool too situation. Long, and then your face gets skin like a it's too late now. A man like a mandarin orange. Like a mandarin orange, exactly. Exactly. Alright, Monokuma, what are you doing in here? Are you gonna actually talk to us now? Yeah. It was the same way that when we went to the library after Rantaro's class trial. All clean. Hmm. Like nothing ever happened. Hmm. 
Ugh, man. I feel tired as fuck. I was up all night fixing that computer. Oh, you took a look at the computer on the fourth floor. So what do you think? Yeah, I only just started working on it, so I don't know the full specs, but... That thing is... pretty good. I mean, it's so intense that it just won't let me sleep. Oh, we're talking about Kibo now? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Are you jealous? Of Kibo? course not. I would never be jealous of your fucking computer. <laughs> <laughs> a robot jealous of a computer. It seems just plain possible. Nice work. Hey guys, am I sleepwalking or something? What's she doing here? Oh, I see. I'm hallucinating. After what Maki said before, there's no way she'd be here. Don't say something so stupid. You'll never get to know her better if you never talk to her. Maybe everyone would prefer that. Maybe everyone would prefer that this dangerous killer stay away from us. Hmm. Of course, I wouldn't prefer that at all. You better cut it out. He's right. Murder and death have no place in a peaceful academy. Life. <laughs> yeah, um, it's like Angie said. Yes. It's like Angie just said. Oh, uh, what? I mean, um, she said it plain. What? Oh, hey, Ganta. Everyone, it's serious. Oh, no. The colossal insect is on the other side of the wall, isn't it? God damn your references! No, 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 not that. Gonda went to courtyard before coming here and. One. Ah, they're here. Okay. Ah. Thank Thanks you for, for bearing, bearing with, us. with us! Very good. Come on! What is it? Why did you call us all of a sudden? We're the ones who called them out. Did you forget that, too? Let's worry about Monotaro later and present the motive now. So it is a motive after all. <laughs> it doesn't matter what the motive is. We will not do the killing game anymore. I don't know why you guys just don't get that. <laughs> Wander? Hello? Anybody? Uh-oh. Uh, uh, he said he'll be right back. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, I'll fill in. Go for it. That, that's right. We aren't afraid of anything anymore. Because we have a Tua. Oh, no. What? Oh, no. She brainwashed them all. She swapped some of their personality traits? Oh, <laughs> this is also wonder. No, There's no ordinary motive. This motive will inspire fear like never before. Fear like never before. <laughs> if you face a fear like never before, you'll have no choice but to unite. Now for the motive that will cast you down into the depths of terror. Whoa. Well, um... We'll, we'll present, present it together. together. I'm so proud of my little kids. This time, the motive is a transfer student. What? Yep, a new student is transferring. And not just any transfer student. <gasps> oh. You get to resurrect one of the four people who've died so far. What? And welcome the them back to the academy we... as a tra transfer student. Oh, sorry. I, yeah, I'm back now. You, you picked okay. the worst time to leave. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm sorry. Well, yeah, we we, we covered all your characters, um, but oh, we they just happened? announced they just announced that there's going to be a new <laughs> transfer student. Do you, and that we get to resurrect one of the four people who have died. Wait, what? Yeah, basically yeah. they're saying we can bring someone back. Well, um, who do we want to bring back? Well, gee, I fucking wonder. Oh, uh, well, uh, Karumi uh, was pretty important. Uh, I trained yeah. students. We we could resurrect someone. 
the instructions for the resurrection ritual are written on the Necromonic Necronomicon. By performing the rituals as written, you can resurrect one deceased victim. But only one of the four who have died so far can become the transfer student. Whoever you choose, that person will be considered part of the killing game of semester. So technically, you can kill him again as soon as they're resurrected. You know, if you want to use it like that. This motive is supposed to bring them closer together. Uh, 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 oh, s s sorry, old habits and such. Monodem, let's forgive Monotaro. Forgiving is what friends do, you know. Monophy, you're nice. Oh, stop it. But there is more to friendship than being nice. Friends also punish each other when they do something wrong. That's why I'll have to punish. I'll have you punish Monotaro. What? Me? No, please, no! Not Monopony! I'm always mocking her when she's not looking! I don't want to be punished by her! Fine, <laughs> I'll do it! Whoops. Oh, okay. So long, bear well. Bear well. So did like all of my characters have lines while I was gone? Yes. Yeah. 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 Oh. Uh, only Maki was skipped in rotation. <laughs> oh, wow. So, we were all completely dumbfounded. I feel like this academy has prepared me for absurd situations, but what I just heard was the most absurd thing so far. I mean, yeah, they just told you they're gonna bring somebody back from the dead. Oh, also, Wander, you missed someone saying we're not afraid anymore. And God damn it! <laughs> Tra transfer student. Re resurrecting the dead. D don't say such a stupid thing. There's no way resurrecting the dead is possible. It just can't happen. Unless we're already dead, and this is all. Oh, wait, we are, yeah, we already had that theory, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. We saw our funeral. Sheesh. Who the fuck would believe that load of unscientific bullshit? Yeah, we saw our funeral and there's a giant computer, so you tell me. <laughs> Disbelief due to a lack of scientific merit is simply the hubris of a scientific society. Is it just me, or have the motives for this game been a lot better, this game? Definitely like, the more unique. The first motive was, hey, kill somebody and I'll just let you go. That's it. That's the end of it. That's... Okay. This ritual, or rather, resurrection ceremony, stems from funeral ceremonies the world over. See, they are similar, duh? The, the act of sending the dead to the next world is a sort of ritual. Through rumors and legends, that ritual twisted into a way to return the dead to this world. A ritual. I'm nervous about this. I just had a flash of Kaide walking at the end of like one of those spooky hallways up in that top floor. Uh, yeah. uh, so we're bringing back Kurumi, right? Because nobody else here can cook. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think that we have to bring back Rantaro because we don't know anything about him. Ah, oh, shit, but I don't like Clearly him. we should bring back Ryoma, guys. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Since you keep rambling about we brought it, you I'm... back. Put me back in. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't ask for this. <laughs> I'm guessing you really believe all this stuff, huh, Kyo? Kihihi. <laughs> what are you saying? There's no way the dead can be resurrected. No way. Without a doubt, the souls of the dead exist, but they cannot be brought back to life. Dead flesh cannot be restored, just as bro broken glass cannot be mended. Well, you'd be surprised. I come from the glass industry, and actually glass repair is something that we have to do often. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Wow, um, he drank okay. real ice himself. <laughs> I'm the ultimate glazer. Sorry. <laughs> um, take it back. So you believe in souls, but you don't believe that those souls can be resurrected? That seems confusing. But I know if we ask, this conversation will just go on forever. Hmm. If n not even Keo believes it, then there's no such thing as resurrecting the dead, and right? Keo will believe, famously believe anything. <laughs> right. And if this idealistic de degener de 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 degenerate can can't believe it, no reasonable girl would believe it either. Mm -hmm. 
You think so? I don't think it's that strange for the dead to come back to life. God yeah, but damn you're crazy. it, <laughs> The kooky bitch is finally talking. Hmm. But too bad. No one's interested in your bullshit cult. Damn. No, wait. Let's hear what Angie has to no. say. <laughs> Kimo, no! <laughs> Yes, Angie is free oh, to speak. Oh, yeah, Wander, you were out of the room, but Tenko and um, and Kibo were both praising Atua. What? Yeah, yep. they were like, we all have room in our heart for Atua now. So there are now four Atua Toten. I do not like this. this. <laughs> like, Kibo, whatever, but Tenko has been, like, against this, this since the beginning. It's spreading. This is not okay. How do we, like, classify it if a Tua kills someone? Mm. <laughs> Angie did it. <laughs> what did I say? Yay! Okay, I'm gonna say it. Because that's what a Tua desires. I can't follow this conversation at all. There's a Tua drugs. What is it? <laughs> Tua, tell me about drugs. There's a Tua, uh, so you believe there's you a Tua the Hypnotoad. <laughs> wow. You believe you can revive the dead, Angie? Um, I don't think the resurrection ritual can really bring the dead back to life. It pro it's probably more like returning the dead to us. What do you mean? You know how bodies of all the victims have been cleaned up? So clean, it's like there was never a dead body to begin with. So maybe they were never dead to begin with. Well, that's ominous. They weren't dead. No, that's not possible. We inspected all of the bodies ourselves. But, but it might have been a very accurate imitation. An imitation? Monokuma and the Exocells are evidence of the ridiculous scientific advancements. So, it may be possible for them to create an extremely convincing imitation. Fucking, I'm just imagining at this point that uh, Kurumi walks into Ryoma's room and it's just a substitute doll in the shape of Ryoma. And she's just shoving it, choking it in the water and handcuffing it. Got one. <laughs> if that's what Angie says, then I'm starting to plainly agree. She definitely didn't have this joke in the first chapter, right? I don't remember. If she did, we wouldn't that. have noticed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I've always supported Angie. Yay! Thank you, everyone! What? What? No, wait a minute. I saw that with my own eyes. Rah, don't raise your voice to Angie, you rude degenerate. Hey, you don't want to li- You don't want them to be a- Hmm? You don't want yeah. them to be- Hey, you don't want them to be alive, Zuichi. You don't want the dead to be alive? I, I do! I do want that! I wish that they were still alive. Even now I think that. But no matter how much we want that... Oh, wait! If everyone alive, that means they're somewhere in school, right? So maybe one of them write message in courtyard? The message in the courtyard? Oh, oh that's, yeah, the that... paint that was on the... Gonta! Wow, you're onto some shit! Gonta, you know about the letters written in the courtyard, right? Yeah, but it's sort of different now. On way here, gone to go see writing in courtyard. Oh. And it have more writing this time. More writing. The worst Nima. Well, there's an I randomly over there. Uh, the worst most Ursine. Er <laughs> uh, most most. Um, hmm. We need more. Thor, I don't know understand what Thor writing means. Names. Maybe. Thor names we. Maybe a message from dead? Maybe everyone leave a message for us to say, hey, we alive. Hmm. A message from everyone who died. Because no one here write it, did they? So someone else must have write it, right? Are you saying a dead person hiding in the school wrote that message? In other words, it's a message from the dead? Spooky. What? A message from the dead? What the actual fuck? Uh. Either way, there's nothing more divine than being reunited with a friend. 
As she spoke, Angie picked the Necronomicon <laughs> off the floor. La 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 la. Yen <laughs> Angie, whatever are you planning to do with that? Are you actually planning to perform the ritual? You do know it's a motive, ye da? But perhaps it's a motive <clears throat> that's dangerous to ignore rather than dangerous to use. For example, maybe the people who died are actually alive. And if we don't perform the ritual, maybe they'll be killed by a certain or time. maybe if we perform the ritual, one of them will be returned and the rest will be killed. I had that line kind of wrong, but I figured it out. Hmm, it would be a problem if we allowed the four potential survivors to die. <laughs> You're so smart for telling us, Gonta! You're a savior to those four people! I do not like where this is going. Huh? And she approached Ganta with her usual wide smile and stabbed him. Nope. Oh. Uh? Wow. She grew. She grew a few inches. <laughs> no. She's about to convert him with love. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. <laughs> you work so hard, Ganta. You're always trying to keep everyone safe. So is he on his knees now? I'm assuming how did so. She, how did he, she make he, him this short? She pushed him through the ground. <laughs> <laughs> she's, standing, she's standing on several apple boxes. <laughs> and then Kiba's, Kiba's just down there, just like squatting. <laughs> just let me know when you're done. Even when you go berserk, you're still considerate of everyone else, aren't you? Oh. I know this because the two eyes always watching you. Always watching Gonta? Don't worry, you're not alone, Gonta. Atua is like a gentle grandmother watching over you and keeping you safe. I thought Atua man. <laughs> Grandmas are nice. Yeah, I thought Atua was a ripped ass burly motherfucker. Now he's a grandma. <laughs> gentle gra Oh, well, okay, Mew. Gentle grandmother, I thought you said a tool was a handsome man. Angie's a tool, it changes his appearance depending on who's looking. A two is whatever you want them to be. It's whatever gets your butt in a pew. Yeah. Well, that's not suspiciously convenient at all. Oh, yeah. Why don't you join our student council, Gonta? Uh -oh. Yeah, it would be really assuring if you were a part of the student council, Gonta. Mm-hmm. You will use your power for the peace of the Academy. <laughs> See how much everyone needs you, Gonta! You should definitely join! I think I like this better than Kokichi, probably. You need Gonta? Okay, Gonta joins Student Council too! Wait, before all of that, what exactly is the Student Council? And is that why you've been acting weird? Last night, Angie summoned us to discuss how we could eradicate the killing game. Me, Kibo, Tenko, and Samugi. And we arrived to a conclusion. Oh, what? Um. <laughs> okay, hang on. With Gonta now, are there more people in this unit council than not? Uh, I think it's half and half. Okay. Split opinion. Is it to a real or no? <laughs> I would actually see them doing that. This is the ultimate academy student council. Well, Angie and Naga are. Oh, wait. Tenko said that. Nope. Uh -oh. Angie and Naga are press. Brand new. Brand wow. new. Ultimate academy student council. We've all banded together under the leadership of President Angie. Our platform. It's the wholesale eradication of the killing game. Wholesale eradication. Oh. Nyaron, our student council promises a killing game free ultimate academy. Oh, you said that? Oh, you said that? <laughs> <laughs> student council and Angie's the president? Yes. There can be no harmony between us if we keep saying different things. Oh, that up. See? <laughs> well, nope. Well, it's called the student council, but all the decision making's done by a tour. I've seen I... this play out before. 
But since Angie can speak with Atua, she's the only worthy. She's the only one worthy of leading the council. Yeah, um, that's right. Yeah, I'm going to follow Angie too. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Atua's happy now. Happy too. Ah, jeez, they've been totally brainwashed. Kehehe. <laughs> And you spread her influence before we've even realized. But it makes sense if you think about it. This place has all the conditions for a cult to form. The fear of a death that cannot be avoided, cults are born from a desire to escape that. I, I love how Korakia is straight up just like, yep, I'm an anthropologist, yep. and this shit's. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Is like <laughs> pornography, duh? You know what when you. <laughs> You'll know it when you see it. <laughs> yeah, like a porn star. <laughs> so she's using the situation to take over the school and make us depend on Atua? Using is a rude way to describe it. The president wants peace for the school, and we all agreed with her noble wisdom. No. We are going to not let anyone talk bad about student council. You literally just fucking joined them, you brainwashed idiot! But I'm surprised Tango decided to join the student council. <laughs> Why? Because you and Angie were fighting over Himiko, were you not? Sister, <laughs> uh, who cares about that? I finally realized how great a two is. Yeah. That's right, that's right! Now, what were we talking about I again? Told it, I told it didn't just join this cult so I could be close to Himiko. Huh? Yeah. Oh, the resurrection ritual, right! Just leave this to the student council. It's a less burdensome. It's less burdensome if Atuma makes the decision. Less burdensome. That's a relief. If it's Atua's decision, then it's definitely the right one. Yes, there's no way Atua could be wrong. Yep, yep, Atua is always right. Are you guys serious? The, res the resurrection ritual is clearly a trap. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine! As long as everyone puts aside the desire to leave. <laughs> I doubt they've listened to anything we have to say. Kirk, you, you laugh an awful lot, dude. Yeah. It's true that they're probably not going to listen, but you could at least help too, Kaido. Uh, what's wrong with him? He's been quiet this whole time. Yeah. Uh, Oh, uh, okay. In the end, we couldn't stop the student council. We left it at that and went our separate ways. Uh-huh. And then... Oh, no, we went back to our room? <laughs> Free time! I think. It is... <laughs> it, it is, is time. time. Oh, there we go. go. Oh, <laughs> it, is it is time! Um, oh, okay, hang on. Hovering over the coin, hovering over the coin. <laughs> I headed to the pool. Oh, yeah, you might want to... Do it now. <laughs> Should I? Okay, all right. I'll bring yeah. it off. I'll, I'll take it off well, if it's not that bad. My heart, sa everything. my heart safety was off, and I was going in <laughs> guns blazing. <laughs> what an incredible sight to behold. My fantasy shining like a supernova. Christ. Oh, okay, yeah, oh. we definitely should not show oh. this. Yeah, no, no, no. Twitch, Twitch should we just see this one. Should, yeah. should we skip the, skip the dialogue? The skip. Hang on. <laughs> Are you are you sure we don't want to read these? <laughs> All right, fine. You want to go for it? Let's do it. Yeah, <laughs> these are so big, Samugi. Do you mind if I touch them? <laughs> what do you mean? I mean, it's embarrassing if you touch them. <laughs> What's wrong, Kamiko? Nothing. It would just be a waste of magic to grow them that big anyway. Oh, oh I understand now. God. God Don't worry. It. They're nicely shaped. Beauty is way better than size anyway. Get here, Jay! <laughs> Get here, Jay! New. <laughs> and then so, the Challenger Approaching boys went to go to their the, the official Challenger Approaching beach vacation. God <laughs> damn it! Look at your dick. <laughs> <laughs> you got quite a dick on you. 
Foss. <laughs> Very impressive, Foss. <laughs> it's okay. Can I touch yours, Ryu? <laughs> <laughs> so this is what Angie was... I put down the coin, by the way. So this is what Angie was planning. A party for the student council. Anyway, I saw it, and then immediately questioned the morality of my actions. <laughs> oh, well, I guess you can't unsee it. <laughs> I just have to keep quiet. Keep it inside. Keep together. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go back to your room. Uh, we leveled You've done up enough. because of that. <laughs> You've done enough today, Shuichi. <laughs> Level up. Transfer students, reviving the dead, Atua, student council. So many heavy qu conversations this morning. I shouldn't just sit here and complain. There has to be something I can do. I have to find something. Free time to be continued. Yeah. Yeah. It's good timing. All right, everybody. Well, that was a situation yeah. I have. <laughs> that was definitely something. <laughs> That was a thing. Uh, I don't even know how to. This episode, this um chapter is looking spooky, and I'm yeah. I'm here for it. Yes, I like spooky. Spooky, spooky, please. Uh, uh, I, I do you think? That... The... Yeah. Well, I just want to say once again my observation about double murder. That there was a double murder in chapter three yeah. thing on Ruffle one and two. Yep. So yep, yep, yep. If there's gonna be a double like... murder, here we go. Yeah. So, do you guys think that they're actually gonna revive somebody? I don't know. I think that Rantaro has to become relevant again somehow. That's fair, <laughs> but I th I think that he just might not be dead. He might mm. not be dead. Mm. Mm. By the way, we're going to be picking this up again next week, everybody. Thank you all so very much for hanging out with us, and we'll yeah. see you next time. See ya. All right. Good Remember, night. always follow your man's fantasy. Don't, don't do not do that. Do not do that. Criminal. Be respectful in any way. <laughs> Bye. <Okay. laughs>